going to play some D&D, aren't we, guys? Round of applause oh, for D&D. Yeah, woo, yeah, woo, yeah, woo, woo, woo clap, woo. Thank you. You can stop now. All right, uh, before we get into today, uh, thank you so much for tuning in, uh, gamers. Uh, thanks for being here and wanting to play and all that. Um, any announcements before we get today's session? I'm through? only here because you're paying me. God, I wish that was true, because if I was able to pay you for this, that means that I am getting paid to do this, and I'm not, so... Yeah, right. <laughs> um, I have you can one change that, chat. You can't gifted. change it. This is true. <laughs> um, my one quick announcement, obviously, for the next little while, my streams are all over the place because of the film festival gig I have, but whenever I am streaming and the link is pinned on all my socials we're raising money for the canadian red cross right now it's a pop-up campaign along with team side quest and it's about helping um provide relief to those affected by all the wildfires going on out west in canada where i'm from it's one of the first canadian causes that team side quest has raised money for so it's important to me and yeah if you want to check out the campaign the link is pinned on things like twitter threads blue sky shit like that so yeah go check that out if you'd like and help support the great charity yeah. All right. Anyone else? Anything? Going once? Going twice? Sold. All right. No fisting, you say? <laughs> I didn't. I didn't say that. To be fair, I don't know. Um. All right. Well, let's just fucking jump into the recap and let's get going because we got we got a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Um. Last we left off. You ventured further into the Whispering Woods, into an encounter against yourselves. You fought these copies of yourselves that had the same abilities and skill set, uh, with some changes mainly to Daigon, whereas Daigon's copy was if basically what Daigon would have been if she was still uh, fully alive. Very uh, depressing. But, uh, you know, do some, do some cool astral body shit. Um, you eventually, after the fight went on for a certain amount of time, I think it was Elazrin woke up first and realized that the party was fast asleep. But he also realized that even though they were sleeping, the injuries they had taken from the battle were very real. Elazrin then quickly woke up the rest of the rest of the crew only to realize that even, basically, even though this was some weird dream, um, it was, one of, you know, it was like a, a Freddy Krueger situation. You know, you die in a dream, you die, you die in real life kind of thing. Um, Inception shit. Yes. You then ventured further until you found a destroyed village in the woods. Uh, the remnants of battle still very much there. Uh, pits of poison and decay eating away at the various huts and trees around the village, um, finding a female humanoid that revealed uh, herself to be uh, a woman named Shasa. Uh, in her humanoid form, various tells that she uh, is a green dragon, which she also showed the party. Uh, she told the party a few things about what happened in the village, uh, that all the villagers were taken away, and that this is something that Brixoff, who she revealed was uh, uh, her father, um, does regularly. Whenever Shasa builds up some kind of village, he comes by and destroys it and leaves her to basically wallow in the remnants of, of it. Um, <clears throat> she then told the party that the only way to get to Brixoff is by finding three parts of a key... A, a green dragon scale covered key uh, that's broken up into three pieces uh, spread around uh, a number of uh, camps inhabited by Brixoth's lackeys, mainly kobolds and other dragonoid horses. Uh, and she told the party that once you find the three pieces, they can return it to her and she'll be able to shape it back into a key and then guide the party to Brixoth's actual lair. Uh, you were then also offered a place to rest in one of the uh, remnants of what used to be a hut. And you did, you did just that. You long rested and you wake up the next morning feeling well rested, feeling... Uh, it's, it's not comfortable being in these woods, knowing that you've already encountered 
various things that aren't particularly uh, great. But knowing that you have to venture deeper and deeper and knowing that if you don't, um, yeah, there's just a lot of bad things that are going to happen if you don't. So it's, it's kind of a, a lose-lose situation. But, alas, you wake up, what would you like to do? So she said to remind me that to find like we just have to basically like focus in our head on what we want yes. and eventually we'll get there rather than like yeah. there's no physical markers or direction. Correct. So, you were basically in instructed that these woods have a way of, for instance, yeah. you had a goal in mind being Shasa's village and eventually, no matter what direction you went, you eventually found it. She basically said it, that's how the forest functions. It throws some. Yeah. Um random areas at you but eventually you'll get to where you want to go so for instance if you now keep in your heads i want to find a cobalt camp that has a key piece eventually you'll you'll wander upon one and that is kind of how you navigate these woods just have a goal in mind and keep that goal in your mind and you shall not get lost okay yeah as you wake uh, up our hero's uh, feast is bye-bye right yes, yes. it's bye-bye mm-hmm as you awaken and eventually leave your hut, you'll notice that Shasa is still sitting in the same position, in the same spot she was sitting in last night. She offered you a place to stay. She has does not seem to move at all. Okay. Hmm. Well, is there anything we need to do before we head out? Or do you think we can just... Go for it. Just start focusing in our heads and see where we end up. I mean, no time like the present. Okay. Well then, <laughs> let's go. I didn't. We didn't get the sense that she was gonna come with us. I'm assuming. <laughs> she told you She's that she would guide there. you to Brixoth's lair once you have the once key we pieces. have the keys. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. She didn't seem to imply that she is going to come with you this entire like to collect them. gotcha then yeah i guess we'll say bye like good morning and see you later to her and then hit the hit the path good eye and good boy he'll look at you and just kind of nods good luck uh don't forget your goal in mind, and you'll find your way. We will. So who is leading you through these woods? <clears throat> who who do we think has the best focus? Or should it be Davian, maybe? Because we're all focusing Davian, on it, but then but... the ranger can also be keeping a bit of an eye on forest threats or natural threats. I don't know. That sounds fair enough to me. Yeah. I can fly in my room and see. <laughs> okay. Oh Just kill it. All right. So, Davian, as you mm. guide the group, um, can you do me two favors? Okay. The first one is um, make a survival check. Okay. The second is only a flat d20. The survival check is a 15. Okay. And the flat d20 is a 7. 7. So with that 15, you try to find the best way to kind of leave this area of the woods, keeping your destination, uh, this, this, this camp, in the back of your mind. Um, you push through and find a path <clears throat> and eventually you stumble upon a beautiful clearing. The air here is thick with the scent of moss and earth tinged with the sweet perfume of blossoms. This clearing, bathed in a gentle otherworldly glow, seems to have been untouched by time. A carpet of white flowers blankets the ground, their petals delicate as silk and pure as freshly fallen snow. Um, make me a nature check. 
Me? Yes. Since you are the, uh, the ranger. Uh, 14. 14. You've not seen these flowers before, but you have heard of them. Uh, these are flowers native to the Feywild, but stories of what can be made with those flowers uh, have reached the other planes as well. These are flowers known as Moon Blossom, uh, said to only bloom under the watchful eyes of the stars, but in this enchanted place they remain in perpetual bloom. Their luminescent petals catch the light filtering through the trees, giving the clearing an ethereal, almost ghostly radiance. The surrounding trees stand as silent sentinels, their bark twisted with age and their branches adorned with silver leaves that rustle softly in the breeze, almost as if whispering secrets. In the middle of this clearing, you see a female hobgoblin picking these flowers, humming a tune to herself. She has not seemed to notice you. Do I recognize the tune? Ooh. Um, make a history check. Gen would recognize okay. it. It would be really True. crazy if, like, of all the checks you've made, nature, survival, mm -hmm. this is the one that I, like, nat 20 on, and then I just, like... Oh, it's a... Did you say history? Yeah. 17. You recognize this tune. You've heard it in taverns on your travels. You don't recall exactly the name, but you do remember that the author of the song was a bar a traveling bard known as Matthias Marnstrom. Yay! Hey! Which yeah. one? Uh, <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> um, the better one. <laughs> so the real Matthias Monster. To... What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I know the song. Um, is she armed? Um, oh, you question. look at her while she's picking these flowers. You do see that she has a longbow strapped to her back. A quiver of arrows. Archery contest. Immediately. Dabby and V. I'll go. I will... How far away are we from her? I will say about 60 feet. I will... I will start singing along the song and I will... jaunt out into the clearing. You seem and... to kind of catch her off guard. And she, like, instinctively, immediately, like, turns around while with one arm reaching for her bow. And then just kind of, like, lets out the sigh. You scared the absolute piss out of me. I love that song. I do, too. I don't really remember where I heard it, but it, um, kind of stuck. Anyway, sorry, I... Sorry about... <clears throat> what are you doing in these woods? You... On the hunt for some prey, trophy beasts that only roam the depths of these woods, or is it something more interesting? So, something a little more interesting than that. But so, before we before we get into all that, what what can you tell me about these flowers that you're picking? Oh well, um, these are moon blossom. Uh, normally, don't really grow in this plane of existence, but. Um, well, a lot of things in these woods don't really make sense for where we are. Um, I stumbled upon these... Uh, well, I've only been here for about half an hour and uh, stumbled upon these, and I happen to know one potion and how to make uh, how to make it that uses these ingredients. Um, which... Is this by any chance a medicinal potion? Not particularly. Um, well, I could hand you one. And she whips out this potion. And the bottom of this uh, vial almost seems to kind of be cauldron esque. And then the top half is glass with like a, a cork in it. And mm -hmm. she hands Davian a moon blossom potion of spell recovery. Oh, um, which is an item that I made in the Indie Beyond, so you should be able to just put that in. Yep. And then you can read Sounds out. Sounds pretty Read out to the class. What it... ba, 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 ba. When you drink this potion, you recover expended spell slots with a combined level that's equal to or less than five. 
Uh, it's said that Moonblossom only grows in the deepest forests in the Feywild, yet legend has it that with great rarity it can be found on the Material Plane as well. Um, so it spells a lot up to just, four? Uh, a five. combined level of five, so you could choose... So you could do okay. like a three and a two, exactly. five level or you ones. Recover, recover one fifth level, or a two and a three, or a two yeah. and a two and just a two and a two and a one. Pretty sick. Like, um, a one or one or one or one or one. Five first levels. Yeah, exactly. As she as she oh, gives God, him the potion God, and Davian like to them like oh, I was just curious because we have a friend who is actually needs some sort of flower from the Feywild for her dad, but it's not it's not that one. Doesn't sound like it's the right one. Oh, that's I'm sorry to hear that. Um, no. So uh, if, if and just to sort of itch the, the the curiosity of the botanist in me. If I were to pick some of these flowers, how long would they last? I, I, you, can you take them out of the forest, or does, do they start to wilt? Like, what's... You could, but once you leave um, the forest, you will notice that they start to wilt pretty quickly. Um, if you were to take them out of the forest, um, you would have to, you know, uh, treat them and, and, and make them into what you want to make with them. Within two days, if not less, um, they don't. Last if you press them, long. if you press them, you know when people press flowers dried and like flat to preserve them, like between pages of a book or something, would that give us like an extra day or two, or not really? I'm not sure. I've never tried that before myself, but um, given that these flowers normally really only exist within the Feywild and natural energies native to that, um, you could try. Uh, as I've never had. I'm gonna it, go I, ahead and I, could I, I, I'm gonna could pick I preserve, one to press. Okay. Could I preserve the flowers with a, a gentle repose spell? <laughs> um, Does it only work on creatures? Does it? It's the wording on the... I don't think it's so. Creatures. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's creature, yeah. Given that, um, you know, flowers and plants do definitely live, I do think that spell... Was made with the them. target, hold on, oh? is a corpse, a corpse or, or other or remains. Remains, remains Not of a, a flower. Mm. <laughs> you could try, I suppose. I've never really tried it before myself. Um, because I really want to... Oh, Celestia would love these things. Yep. Well, I'm going to pick one and, and very carefully lay it out in between the pages of my journal, but also lay it so it's like a maximum pretty shape. Because I'm like, if it doesn't work, then I'll just make, keep, make it a souvenir for Kess so she has a memento of home even when she's here. Yeah, just add, I'm, uh, I'm going to add pressed moon blossom as like a custom yeah. item. Why don't we, yep. if we pick like a bunch of them, one of them will survive for Celestia. <laughs> well, I don't, I don't want to, you know... Completely we don't want to this grove of them. them. I was thinking. No, maybe. I'm thinking like five. I mean, we could just. What if? What if the forest gets mad? It seems <laughs> like a place where that sh that shit would happen. Forest is a <laughs> is a temperamental one. That is that is. Sure. Good. Just we pick all the flowers. They all decay before we can sell them. We're like, fuck, <laughs> wasn't even worth it. Um, Jess, I I I I suppose I should be be going again. Uh, I've I've got what I came for. Um, good luck Wait, what's hunting your. My name is. <laughs> some shit. DM heroes, real quick. Uh, Slightly important. Um, my name Fancy is. Fancy name generator. My name is Tinir. Tinir. T i n i r. Okay. And um, well, I doubt we shall meet again, but I wish you well on your travels and whatever that prey is you're hunting. May it be uh, a quickly, glorious hunt Washi's... and an even better fight. Hmm. While she's talking, can I use my night web detector and see if mm. it's going off? Uh, it's not. Okay, cool. <laughs> it pings, but it's one of the flowers or the trees. The, flower, the flowers and potion it are pings, actually it's just poison. You. It's a no, no. <laughs> If you actually look from an aerial view, the flowers growing in a night in like a the in night the web shape web, like, in the spider web with the sword. Web. Yeah, it's like. <laughs> it's actually just a poison that deals like twenty d ten damage. Yeah. And she uh. Gives you all a gentle bow and starts heading out of the forest. I'm going to pick three moon blossom okay. and sort of just put them into a, uh, a bouquet, and then I guess I 
tuck it behind my ear or something. Okay. <laughs> Into my hair. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I was thinking putting it in the bag of holding, but then that's technically removing it from the forest, and then who knows what'll happen in the however long it's in there. So, for the time being, my head is adorned with moon blossom, and at some point I will have a laser and ritual cast. If well, you need to prepare it, wouldn't you? You probably don't have it prepared. I'm sure they'll last the night okay. and the I'll dragon also, fight. I'll also pick. Uh, I'll just pick one flower and I'll put it in like. The buttons, like a fire pal, try to thread it through. Button, button, Ooh, let's grab the button. Very cool. Yeah. Uh, other than that, this clearing is 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 what it is. There's just a bunch of beautiful moon blossom growing and blooming. Uh, other than that, not much else. So, if that is you guys continuing on, then Davian, I would ask you again to roll me a survival check. And a uh, random, just flat d20. Survival check is 12. Right. Flat d20 is 11. I'm getting poo poo caca rolls today. Um, you see, was 12. <laughs> Ooh. So you you on and you happen to stumble upon some cobalt tracks that just kind of seem to apparate in front of your eyes you okay. the, your your target in, in in your head as, as much as possible and it seems that these tracks just kind of appear uh, and you follow them and as you follow these tracks you reach a scarred and desolate expanse the trees that once stood tall and proud with their canopies forming a lush green cathedral are now twisted the branches once heavy with life now hang lifeless like skeletal fingers God. grasping at the sky in, in a silent plea. The ground, once carpeted with soft moss and vibrant undergrowth, now a barren wasteland of ash and scorched earth. The rich, loamy scent of the forest has been replaced by an acrid stench of sulfur and burnt wood lingering in the air like a bitter memory. Patches of soil have been torn up, leaving jagged craters where you can see dragon claws and tail markings struck there with merciless force. Amidst the destruction... You also see pools of sickly, bubbling green ooze kind of dotting the landscape here. Their edges lined with twisted blackened remains and dead plants that succumb to toxic fumes. The ooze sizzles softly, a faint vapor rising from the surface, warning of its deadly potency. And I would like all of you, unless you're immune to poison, to make a constitution saving throw. Ba 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 bum. Nice. Ba ba ba. Uh, thirteen for me. Thirteen. Nine. Assuming it's not a spell. Constitution save. Unless you're immune to poison. Oh, trip. I'm immune to poison. Eighteen. Sorry. Eighteen. Okay. Uh, 18 was the DC. Ba ba Again. Ba ba bum. Second time, Duke. Just roll just. Just enough. <laughs> um, so you are fine. You breathe in the fumes, and it doesn't really seem to affect you. The other two, um, so that it's like that walking being... into the bathroom after someone, you exactly. Know? And Lazarin they come out and either. Jax, you breathe, and you just feel this burning sensation in the back of you, filling your lungs. Um, you I just didn't even get my fucking dice out yet. Hold on. Oh shit! My bad. Wow, what a bad deal. I mean, ba, ba, you, you that means we don't take any damage. damage every time, and then you don't need dice. Ba, ba, you know. True. Um. Oh my God. Jax and like Lazarin, that. you take twenty-five points of poison damage. Half oh, because I'm resistant. There you go. Same. Twelve. And you I are considered poisoned. You mean you have disadvantage? And you also Yikes. feel. That even though you you know you took this damage, you uh -oh. feel this burning sensation just stuck with you. Um, uh oh. You get the sense that you need to get out of here as fast as you fucking can. I will. I will cast. Hold on. I will cast protection from poison on each of them. Okay. If it is poisoned, you neutralize the poison. Okay, beautiful. Does it also make them immune to poison damage? 
Uh, for the duration, the target has advantage on saving throws against being poisoned, and it has resistance to poison resistance. damage, not immunity. Okay, okay. So you feel the the innate, um, just like the sluggishness and the nausea mm. that you feel disappears, but you still feel that like burning tingle yeah. in the back of your lungs. Oh. Uh, you you feel like you should probably get out of here as fast yeah. as you can. Yeah, uh, it's a big cup of tea. Like, we need to get out of here. Yeah, well, power oh, walk. God. Power walk out of here. Um. Yeah. Okay. Get fuck out of here. Cool. Uh, Davgan, since you are still yeah. kind of leading the pack, can I get another survival check and? Yeah. Let's see if I can roll 20. double digits this time. He can, but it's a ten exactly. Fourteen. So. Fourteen. Wait. No. Hold on. Yeah. Fourteen for Four. the survival. Okay. Sixteen on the d twenty. So the survival check, you now kind of looking in the direction that you previously followed these these cobalt tracks, which are like these these very small little little draconic footsies that you've been tracking. You know, also track bigger footfalls, heavier footfalls. What seem to be these larger, not quite dragon claws, but what you could only guess is some kind of bigger. Uh, Draconic creature that isn't a kobold. Uh, with very deep, heavy footfalls, and he's like, this like drag mark next to where it's where it, where it walked. Very thin, but deep, almost as if dragging a blade alongside of it. Something. I'm just cutting through the dirt. Um, and eventually, following these tracks, you meander onto a small circle of rooms in the middle of the woods. There's a small clearing where sunlight filters softly through the canopy above, casting dappled patterns on the forest floors. The clearing is a perfect circle. It's grass, lush and grass, grass lush and vibrant, grass. contrasting with the surrounding trees' dark trunks and thick underbrush. The air is cool and still, with only fa the faint rustle of leaves in the gentle breeze. At the very center of this clearing lies a mysterious circle of runes etched into the earth. The runes are carved deeply into the soil. Their edges sharp and precise, suggesting an ancient and forgotten ritual. Each room oh, no. glows faintly with a subtle otherworldly light, the colors shifting between soft blues and greens, as if imbued with magical energy. The symbols themselves are intricate and otherworldly, their meaning lost to time, but evoking a sense of power and mystery. I'd like to use my rod of magic detection. Mm -hmm. uh, what kind of magic is it? Uh, illusion. Okay, does anyone understand what any of these runes mean? This is Do so far any of us? from my field of expertise. Um, <laughs> are you getting close enough to like read the runes? Sure. Okay. Sure. <laughs> Hesitantly. Make an arcana. Okay. I don't know. I don't want to spoil anything. Mm -hmm. But this is the Tales Five map. So. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. <laughs> That has nothing to do with this, dude. No. Okay. No, no. I think you're just kind of reading into it. No, nah, man. I don't see no runes. <laughs> <laughs> the runes. Uh, dirty twenty. Are crystals in the sales Dirty twenty. No. Yeah. Wrong. Um, as you approach, you read the runes, and it just—it's gibberish. You don't—you don't make any sense of it. And as you read it, you suddenly hear. A cackling voice echoing throughout this clearing. Oh, mm, look like at that. this, dear sisters. Our next meal. Oh, stumbling thanks. right into our ground. And in oh, the middle no. of this rune circle. Shh. Um, it's going to be hags, isn't it? Three hags. Just no, just it's going to be three of hags, guys. Okay. And I would like you all to roll initiative. More like three shags, am I right, Up fellas? Hags, dude. <laughs> Some fucking initiative going. Can I? Oh, nope. I hell yeah. Even worse than I normally do for I initiative. To give you guys access. Or yeah, baby. Oh, I, I did. I yeah, did I'd did like to be able to kind of. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, hold on. Maybe I get this out of the way now. You know? The other question is, how much do you want to burn in a fight like this before you fight something maybe worse? Let's see. I know, right? Dragon. We don't burn much. Permission. The problem I have is if I burn, if I don't burn shit, 
sometimes like every fight i've gone i don't need the dome we'll be fine it like has just fucking backfired instantly and i'm like <laughs> god damn it all <laughs> like every, it happens every time and then oh, i like, do so tall. why are they so yeah. fucking tall dude why are they so hot yeah dude, don't look. Hey, man. you gross what the uh, hell Laura, are, are you like? shaming the hags? Hold on. Shame for what? Are you Soko shaming Soko light? for wanting the, the hag? Fuck? Light? <laughs> That's the fucked up. That's Laura. actually real fucked up, Laura. I'd expect better from you. <laughs> That's, you of uh, all people, man. Shield, and can I get Holy the shit. Of 20 or more. Natural 20, 20 bitch. Natural 20? Damn straight. Yours wasn't for a total 19. I'm never going to go first in initiative. Isn't that for a total 19, right? Yes. <laughs> No, it's total of 18, uh, dude, actually. Yeah, yours wasn't oh, 20, right? 23. Yeah, but it wasn't natural 20? No. Um, 15 to 20? 17. 17. What did you roll, Laura? A uh, natural one for a total of four. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, Laura's, Laura, Laura's, Laura's back, back baby. baby. Just let you right into the back there. <laughs> if there's Let's balance go. in all things. All right. No. Jax, you get to go first. Dude, this is the first time I've ever gone first initiative. Because oh, the last shit. time I rolled a natural 20, someone else did too. Oh, sure. Uh, Unless one of the enemies did. Usually that's what happens. Dutch rolls like a fucking out of his ass, I swear, dude. Um, That's the best dice tower. That's how I roll. What, you eat you, it? You have to wait you a swallow few days. It and then just, yeah. Uh, I am going to pull out the furnace hammer. Okay. Then I'm gonna use my bonus action to activate it. All right. Run up. Oh my god, look how small Jax is. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even waist height, bro. And then I'll try and hit. Uh, how do I mark it? The one right in front of me. Okay. Emerald sister number three, yes. Okay, your attack. first hit. That hits. 17? Just hits. Oh. 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 Hey. <laughs> For 10 points of fire damage. 10 points of fire and, damage. Um, only 8 points of Bludgeoning. 18 points of damage total. All right. Okay. Oh, I need to do it separate. Oh. Um, and then the next one is a 19 to hit. Hits. Or six points of fire. Okay. Um, 12 points. Uh, so 18 points of damage. 18 again. There you go. Mr. Consistent. I'm so consistent, man. <laughs> All right, anything else? Um, I think that's my turn. All right. Gavian. Uh, I cast a fifth level fireball at him. Okay. It hit me with the two. I think he can like kind of launch he it. Can oh, no, no, he can position it. Yeah, I think there's a way like... yeah, that I can... I'm sure there's a way you can position it like back and off to 20 a foot radius, I believe. 20 just... foot. No. You'll definitely be able to get all three of them without getting. Yeah. Four so, tiles. well. For sure. Yeah, if but if I. you position like one tile further that way, diagonally that way, you'll get all three of them without. There you go. I can't. How do I, how do I move it again? I don't... Uh, you just try again. Whatever. We, hey, whatever. Yeah, I can hit yeah, yeah, it further. You, you can do that. It's yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, okay. make saves. it's doable. Yes, please. It's possible. Uh, is there a bonus on Dex? Hold on. Eight. Uh, the highest I rolled is, is a 15. 15 is the DC. Okay, so one of them saves, the other two don't. Okay. Oh, uh, For... which one rolled 15? Uh, we'll say the further back one. Um, I'm going to Silvery Barbs it, so it has to re-roll. Okay. Uh, that was a natural 16, so that's better. Okay. Shit. <laughs> but who are you giving the advantage to? I am giving the advantage to who's the next in initiative? Me. Uh, oh, Lazarin. Uh, uh, Lazarin's next. But you. Honestly. Hmm. 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 Fuck. 
Is yeah, yeah I'll give it to a Lazarin. I'll, I'll give it to a Lazarin, because, okay. yeah. It's just same line that we Right. <laughs> as soon as that dump comes up, it'll be hidden. Uh, you think? No. Hags are done, right? 31. Jesus. Points of fire damage. Yeah. Nice. If they didn't yeah, save? 31. Wait, is that at 5th level? Huh? Wait. Mm, how many it's 86, roll? not 5th level. Okay, so, uh, so I need to roll... Jeez. Two more. Yeah. 37. Nice. Points. Fire damage. Right from my staff of power. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, right, good. Good. Oh, that's 18 points of damage. So, hmm. So fucking hard. It's crazy. Probably like Dutch, it's 36 minus 37. They're dead. Oh, right. Yeah, my bad. All right. Yeah, so you, you <laughs> hurl this fireball and it just explodes. And you can see once the orange and red kind of lights kind of dims down. You can see all three of these hags kind of singe marks and kind of one of them quickly put it like patting out a flame on, on, on her clothing. Uh, they do all three like look at you. Like, just kind of like glaring at you. Okay. I'm gonna fucking leave. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you just run out of the complete He just forest. runs away and leaves us in the forest, <laughs> bro. And has gone. Um, and just cast some visibility. Onu is going to help. Uh, Daigon. Huh? Onu was given Daigon the help action. Ogun is, oh, yeah, Ogun? Yeah. Onu Ogun. is going to help Daigon. Ogun. Okay. Ogun. Onu is helping Ogun. 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 All right. Um, is that your turn? Uh, yes. Now the turn for the first Emerald sister. And she is going no, she get a turn. to last insect. Oh god. That's um, fucking great. Right. Good thing we have a counter spell. Oh wait. Yeah. Just one of the hiking cool. <laughs> There. All hmm. the creatures in that dome need to. Mm, where is it? No, that's me. I don't Call like my swarming oh. biting locusts for like 20 foot radius sphere centered on the point in range. Uh, area is lightly Lusks. obscured, and you are now also in difficult terrain. Uh, I need you to make a constitution saving throw. Yep. That includes Onu, by the way. Oh, piss off. No, it doesn't. Or Onu. <laughs> yes, it does. Oh god. Uh, rolled it out of the oh, dice no, tray. I just decided. Okay. Um so I rolled it out of the dice tray mm -hmm. and it was single digits, and I was like, good, doesn't count. And then I rolled it in the dice tray, it only went up by one. So nice. that's a total of thirteen. Okay. <laughs> Four. Four. Was wait, it, you said a constitution saving. Oh wait, us? hang yeah. on, I got I have advantage, don't I? I don't know, do you? Yeah, from Jax. Huh? By the way, do I have advantage on next roll? Mm. From right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Onu's help what's... action doesn't help me with saves, right? It's only like so, actions on my uh, turn. I don't know, actually. So my I doubt it, but my glorious, glorious two that I rolled up. originally has changed to a two that I rolled again. Next, oh my god. <laughs> the next ability check it makes to perform the task you are helping with. Okay, ability so, check, so this not is not same. an ability yeah. check. Oh well. I had to check, you know. I don't remember, and I need to double check. I think Onu gets my Saving throw. Probably get your remember. physical ones right, and then. I don't. I, I'm. I'm looking now. Man, this is a really quick TPK, bro. No man, insect play doesn't do that much Listen, damage. Man, there were supposed to be four of these before I knew. I that know. That's, that's right. That's, that's what I'm saying. I, I know you nerfed it. That's all <laughs> like shit, dude. Yikes! There were supposed to be four of them. <laughs> this is nerfed. Ethan and Bell uh, gets out. <laughs> Later, Later, we we 
That is true. We always knew Ethan was gonna hit. Ethan's quit D and D, so. Shame. <laughs> Shame. Uh, either either way, like if he. Piss me off. It's on final beast. Draw strength from your bomb nature. Choose a stat block. Uses your proficiency bonus in several places. You decide what kind of animal it is. In combat, extra in your turn. Sacrifice one of your attacks. Well, if it doesn't say it there, then I can only assume that you just take whatever stat it has in the stat block. Is it a feature? But it, it doesn't get saving throw stats. It just has. Yeah, what you do in that case is just. Uh, whatever. Ability modifiers, but it does have my. Proficiency bonus. That's what it is. So it'd be, what's it proficient in? It'll say, what's the throws it proficient in? If no, any. it doesn't. Well, then it's not in any then. <sighs> Fuck it. Um, just for the sake of. Just roll first. If you roll, I low, did. it might not matter. What did you roll? What? 17 on the die. Okay, well, he's fine then. He's fine. Okay. He's fine. Okay. <laughs> Well, his con modifier is a plus one as well, so it's, like, it's an 18 total. But I swear I remember seeing someone. I'll, I will do some reading while yeah. the rest of this. Uh, cool. Let me just double check to see if saves equal no or half damage. Half damage. So it's still, the owner still takes damage. So, owner pass, Laszlo fail, uh, Dagon also fail, right? Yeah, 13. Okay. Um, 6, 12, 19. Your proficiency 20. bonus goes to all companion saving throws, by the way. Okay. There you go. Um, 28 points of piercing damage. I'm going to use my reaction to... 14 to Onu. ...obfuscate Onu. that. 28 piercing, you Yeah. Say? Actually, I have a question. As these bugs all begin to fucking... I have a question. Because hmm? I'm... I'm resistant to bludgeoning, piercing, slashing, but I think that's only in my ghost form. That's not when I'm in my body, right? My robo-body? Correct. Okay, then I'll use the reaction to obfuscate and half it anyway. So 14 to Onu Nukulton. Uh, and you notice that this cloud of insects is still very much there. It stays around. He's constantly kind of like instinctively swatting at these bugs, but however many you swat with your hands, more and more seem to kind of just bzz, 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 around you. Um, Gross. She is also going to back up. And that is her turn. Lazarin, uh, because you are starting your turn in the insect cloud, I need to make another concept. No, I, I know this I know this game. I know this trick. <laughs> uh, this, this is a spell that I can get. I, Ah, oh, sweet. 11. Fail again. So you take another... Roll of shit. Uh, 14 points of piercing damage. Cool. Right. What would you like to do? Uh, first things first. Uh, Get oop. that. <laughs> get oop. Yeah. <laughs> well, hang on. What is it like? What? 5, 10, f Actually, I'm going to get to just out. Just out. Oh, because it's difficult rain. Yeah, correct. Yeah, yeah. Uh, hmm. Now, yeah, I will. I'll fucking dome up. Okay. Get dome out. Get the whole thing dome out. Yeah. Uh, what's the radius coming? Thirty. Thirty. Fucking six. Six. The way you said dome up just makes me think of a Lazarin in the style of like Johnny Storm from Fantastic Four, going like flame on. He's like dome up. And ah, dome fucking up. deleted it by <laughs> accident. <laughs> Shit. Shit ass kids. And then, as a bonus action, I'm going to cast Mass Healing Word at 4th level. Ooh. Okay. Can you heal over that? Oh, you can. Uh, so, basically, who the fuck needs healing who's in 60 feet? 60 feet, yeah. So I think only Onu, Daigon, and you have taken damage so far. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Let's, let's take a bit, right? Because the poison yeah. earlier. Oh, it's true. Yeah. You guys got poison fucked as well. Oh, yeah. Some of you got poison damage. Not me, because I'm an alpha male Chad Apex Predator Sigma. 
Shut up. He's been fer you've been pheromone maxing as well, right? So Yeah. I've been looks maxing. Oh, disgusting. Uh that is eleven for everyone. Oh hell yeah. Almost hundred percent. I was gonna uh, say I'm almost back to full, baby. It's cool, I'm still, my main um, game. I'm I'm still very bloodied. So Okay, that's good. Blurry bodied. Blurry bodied. And that'll be my turn and I get a fucking fifteen temporary no, sorry. Sixteen temporary hit points. Yeah. And that's my turn. Mm -mm. Bad things are about to happen to me, boys. All right. <laughs> it's now Emerald Sister number three's turn. She is going to Another insect plague. Another insect plague. Just surrounded bugs everywhere. Uh, I know this is the one. We can move She's going nowhere. to cast Healing Word on herself as a bonus action. What the f no, That's cheating. Uh, healing Word. Uh, healing shit, level. dude. Mid spell. Not allowed. What the fuck? She's copying me. <laughs> That's why I did. What the hell? No, you cast Mass Healing Word because you are uh, uh, alpha an male. alpha male. Sigma. Yeah, sure. Chad. Yeah, but this one heals her for more. Skibbity. Uh -huh. Riz King. I hate it here. Skippity. Was for LSU quarterback Baby Gronk. The fuck you calling? Baby Gronk interlinked. Okay. And then for her main action, she's going to use an ability called Maddening Cackle. Uh, each creature within 30 feet of the hag and that are able to hear the hang, which is... Every Jax, body. Laszlo. Uh, Tegan is just out. Bonus yeah! Just out. Me. Sorry. Because it's six tiles, right? And I'm six points. Uh, you could just draw a six tile circle. Yeah. Um, Dutch? I guess so, yeah. Huh? I, I, I'm pulling out my inner reverse card. Okay. So. Yeah. Well, then it's just Lazarin. No. Uh, both no. you and Lazarin, I need you guys what? to make charisma saving throw. No, what the, what the hell? I'm not oh, listening. Oh, wait. I have an advantage on these. Hold on. No, wait. I'm, I'm just not listening. Lol. Right, but you can still hear. <laughs> you don't have to listen no. to be able to hear. No. La, 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 la. Yeah. What's up? Uh, oh, yeah. is, is it a this, charm effect? Is it a charm effect? No, it's not a charm effect. Yeah, I had to ask. Yeah. Fucking. Ooh, what did you say? Charisma? charisma? Oh, 18. 18 for me. Oh, 18 for me as well. 18? 18? Fails. Fail. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wait, actually? <laughs> yep. Yes. Oh, Shocker. Oh, what? Shocker. Uh, -oh. uh, you take. Uh -oh. This is so good. <laughs> you each take 17. Oh, no, 19 points of psychic damage. No, 17 is fine. Uh, and. Sorry, my headphones came out. What nice. Happened? Good one. 19 points 19 of psychic 19 points of psychic damage. Mm -hmm. And. Mm -hmm. Elazrin. Oh, no. You need to use your reaction yep. to run to Davian and make a melee attack against him. Oh. Mal, I don't have a reaction. You don't have a reaction. Uh, I already used mine this round, bitch. Well, I can't move me. <laughs> right, so... I'll move you. So I'll move you to Davian. Oh, oh my trees goodness. Anyway. There's trees. There's fucking trees in the way, mate. Is he 30 feet away? <laughs> okay, can I just say... um funny coincidence we're fighting hags and you know the steam notifications would pop up when someone Eggs. on your friends list is playing a game someone just popped up on my notifications a tasty hag ussy is playing dead by dead what a weird coincidence oh, oh. <laughs> there you go yeah, yeah i need you to make a melee attack against uh Davian. i dislike that luckily it's the You're highest of today oh <laughs> so it's a 25 to hit <laughs> weapon are you using? Um, oh, I'm using my dragon bone cleaver. Yeah. Okay. He's and he's a dragon now, so. Yeah, yeah. Luckily, it is only six points of damage. Okay. Six points of magical slashing. But I can do that. That feels that feels like a charm. Just saying. No. It's not a charm. Like it's not it's, a charm effect. It's just. That's it's, fucking you, crazy. You, you weren't charmed. You were maddened. Oh, that's uh... true. Fuck off, DnP. Fuck. It. There you go. I'm just being um, a whiny baby is whiner. Her, me turn. her sister I'm like, sorry. is now going to run away crying. Do the same thing. I should have hellish rebuked Elijah. 
<laughs> How dare you? Like, ah! Oh! What's funny is if you did, there's a good chance you could kill me. You could knock me out. <laughs> Please don't. Hmm. This hag is going to look at Jax. What the fuck? I did nothing. And I need Jax to make them. a wisdom saving throw. At least I have advantage, I guess. You win these, right? With advantage, I do. First one was a three. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yikes. Uh, wisdom, you said? Mm hmm 21. Okay. You ain't gotta do shit. Love that. Damn straight. Uh, I'm my own man. I'm Alpha Sigma fucking grinding, bro. She's I'm fucking going... Alpha Centauri out here, bro. <laughs> she's then going to walk up Jax and make a claw attack. Oh, she doesn't want to kiss? Natural 20. Oh. What the f- Oh, no. Yo, Zan, oh, you better get your boy, dog. Get your boy, dog. <laughs> You take 43 points of slashing damage. Ah! Oh, no. Okay. It's funny, dude. It's just straight slashing? Yeah. Is this from earlier? What the like, fuck are just these, bro? Baby fights and I need you <laughs> to make a constitution saving throw. No. I mean, I have a plus nine of those at least. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Oh, my bro, God. Why'd you say it? You bro, mean? are you fucking kidding me? Do you Laura, not want it? Fuck your dice. Your dice is shit. <laughs> hey, my wedding dice roll fine for everyone else, okay? Uh, it's a natural uh, one. Natural one? <laughs> for ten total, if that matters. Nope. Um, what's your strength score? Fucking 19? It's not uh, It's 15 now. Uh, actually, that can't change because my gauntlets change it to 19, so. So is it your natural whatever pre gone? So I don't actually know how that works, to be honest. I don't well, know what, what the interaction the, uh, is like. It still happens, because this basically this magical effect over overwrites that. So your strength score is reduced by four. That's just the rules. Oh dear. So you and I have 15 strength. <clears throat> okay, let me... Um oh, no. that's her turn. I can. Oh no. Okay, I have a question before I commit to what I'm doing. Oh, uh before you do anything else, make a constitution. Oh yeah, time. I have to roll because I'm in the fucking Yeah. Oh, I rolled roll good. 22. Okay, so you take half damage. Okay. Uh, Do you get your reaction back at the start of your turn or the end of your turn? End. Start. Start? Okay. Oh. oh. You used to start your turn, right? Because uh, then... Mm -hmm. Let's double check that. Let's sure. it out. Because I feel like that's when, like, boss shiver starts as well as at the start of their turn. Oh, oh gosh. I only know that it comes back yeah. on your turn. Yeah, I've already until the start of your next turn. Yeah, start, start. Um, okay, start. Okay, so I have my reaction. You take really eighteen, bad. half nine points of fishing damage from the bugs. To... Okay, I'll leave it. I'll leave it half then. Okay. Um. So my question is, because Onu, Davian slash Onu gave me the health action. Yeah. But my sympathetic mending that I want to do would not benefit in any way from that. Correct. No. But what I would love to do. In an ideal world, and I think only because I have the help, because it's like we're both doing it, and I would like, um, like gesture to Onu for him to come with me and help me do it. Could I bonus action only because I have Onu's help? Could we run up to the rune circle and try and like scuff out one of the runes to like break the circle as a bonus action? Sure. So just like running up and we're wiping my foot on it, and Onu also like flying down and like using his claws and like feel like slashing. Can I runes. just? Based on information that we already have, a little bit metagamey, the runes well. were complete nonsense, gibberish, and it was just an illusion that the hags were just stood there, and the runes don't actually do anything. Uh, well, so with there's that no note, reason the only person with knowledge that the runes are gibberish is Jax. Surely yeah. that would have been. Because no? hmm? I asked him to check it out, right? So surely it would have been like, uh, they don't. Do anything? <laughs> yeah, sure, sure, sure. Okay. The then, roads don't do anything. Then. Thanks, DM. Mind... He doesn't do anything. <laughs> he, doesn't, he doesn't do anything. <laughs> um. Action also. Okay. Well then. Because see, the problem is like, you look you look really bad. I feel like you need healing, but it is a waste of Onu's help action. But there well, isn't, isn't a lot of healing. The next time you make an ability check or whatever, is does it not? 
I guess ability check. Well, it only works until, yeah, but... until Onu gets the next turn. Yeah, I guess. yeah true. And sympathetic true. mending isn't an ability check, really. Yeah, I but just... it's just a help action. Who cares? True. Okay. Um, I'm going. Well, first, let's get out of this bug circle because it's icky. And it's difficult terrain in there. Mm -hmm. oh, yep. it's difficult yeah, it's difficult terrain. There. So your movement is halved. Uh, uh okay. You exit. And these the squares bubble. are are these squares ten feet? Because there's like two things in there. Uh just draw draw a ruler. Figure it out. Oh, well, the ruler just tells you tiles. The ruler doesn't tell you. Yeah, yeah. tile is five the feet. Tiles. That is just okay, D and D math. But I can move my thing like within that a also, tile. Uh, yeah, yeah, spaces. yeah. Okay, so these squares are two by two, but you could also just use your oh, okay. arrow keys gotcha, to gotcha. move around. And you will travel five feet at a time. It, it, it I is, don't have arrow keys. It's difficult terrain too, right? Okay. She doesn't have arrow keys on her keyboard, uh, guys. She's a fucking gamer <laughs> keyboard. Five, ten. Okay, no, that wouldn't make it, I don't well, no, think. I'm it's like it's right double. in the middle. I'm basically not going to make it out of this. Look, Laura, I'll say it's difficult terrain, right? So. Wait, five, ten, fifteen. I can just, I have to yep, take. That's the only path I can take. It's fifteen feet, my whole movement. Um, and then action, I will. Sympathetic mending on a Lazarin because he's what's looking the, real. What's the range on sympathetic mending? Uh, that's a good question. I will tell you. Uh, me, me, me. Uh, One million. A creature within 30 feet. I'm not Ooh. within 30 feet. Okay. <laughs> that's a. Yeah, because my because my because my dome be thirty feet I radius and if that's Hold my on, center. Hold on, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. I could hit Jax with it, and Jax is also injured. I am. I am bloodied for one of the first times in a while. Actually. Yeah. Okay. Then we'll oh. sympathetic mending on Jax. Yeah, fuck that Elasmograph. Uh, I rolled almost max, which is nice. You get nineteen. Oh, you get nineteen hit points back. And my body is back up to full from the residual. Like my robo body repairs as that happens. Uh, I don't get temp HP, and I can't really do any bonus actions in this moment. Um, other than it's this is purely for flavor, and I can't. It won't actually mechanically do anything unless maybe Dutch gives me a point of inspiration for being creative. Um, because of the insect cloud, like, my robot body, because I can, like, alter its shape, right, and do simple cosmetic changes. Um, anything that before looked like, you know, had, like, like the ears, metal will go over them and close off the cat ears, like, uh, the feline nose. Like, basically, it's, like, anywhere that would be, like, a fake orifice is closing off to, like, minimize the distraction of the bugs and the sound of the buzzing and then being able to get, like, into the robo body or anything like that. It's again, I don't expect it to do anything. It's mostly just for Yeah, flavor, I mean, but... yeah, sure. <laughs> just fucking just... That's fine. It's like I'm a Pokemon casting Harden, and now it is <sighs> over my robo body. Locked down. <laughs> um, That's my turn, I guess. So you have no more movement. Okay. Right. Yax. Yeah, um... Question. Um, potentially doing something dumb here. <laughs> we love that. Because I'm honestly pretty worried looking at mine and the Lazarus health bars. <laughs> if, what would you consider pulling a, um, where is it? I just need to make sure I still have it in here. Did I fuck it? This is a pro I really need like remember what I need things. Guess wait, I wait, hang on. Hang on. Uh huh? I'm not gonna wreck on anything mechanically, it doesn't change my turn, but uh instead. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If I leave my body back where it was, the bug thing, mm -hmm. I could use feline agility to get to Jax, and then instead my bonus action would be possessing or hitchhiking with Jax, instead of just like doing the alter shape thing. Yeah. Then your body would just still be in that yeah, insect spawn though, and, and you'd be taking to... fucking damage. Yeah. It would It would still take damage? Yeah. yeah. Uh... The body has, okay. like the metal, the robot body has an HP pool, 
as Why would two. the bugs just attack metal with nothing in it? Then it's the okay, fucking bugs, man. Yeah, I know, I know. We'll leave it. Then we'll leave, Magic we'll leave bugs. my turn. We'll leave my turn I say, as is. That might be dumb considering what I'm doing. Anyways. Okay, well, just because I wanted um, so I could use my divine barrier as a last ditch to help you, but I'll just next turn we'll see what happens, and I can use my feline agility to get to someone next turn. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah. never mind. So I have a bucket of gunpowder. Okay. Would pulling it out of the bag of holding be considered my free action? Your free ultra Are you pulling now? a Brooks right now? No. Thinking about <laughs> it. Hypothetically, since Jax is smarter than I am and me dumb. Right. How big of a radius would this bucket of gunpowder explode? Wait. Like we're talking like 30 feet or... Make it make an intelligence and? check. <laughs> like 10 foot. Come on. Not that big. No, 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 no. It's only a bucket. It's only pack. It's only it's compacted gunpowder. It's only a buckload of gunpowder. Yeah, compact, gun yeah, okay. of gun powder. yeah it's just compact. In one yeah. concentrated dose. Yeah, compact. When it's compacted, it's less effective. Doy, come on now. Yeah, it's only like 40 grenades worth of gunpowder. Oh, yeah. Setting <laughs> fire to a container full of gunpowder can cause it to explode, dealing damage to creatures within 10 feet of it. Okay, that's better than I was hoping for. I'm a fucking genius, guys. I need just 10 feet. Um, it's dropping something is considered free as well, correct? So free, honestly? Like dropping a weapon so you could just grab, like usually the dropping the weapon you can, is the free. Yeah, but then... the thing is, argument here is there's already a free object interaction in... Mapping. Yes, that's, that's why I'm kind of like, it. I don't... Uh, so I'd say you can, on the same turn, also drop right, it, drop but you it with would a have to sacrifice a bonus action. action for that. Okay, so and, I was actually not giving you two action. free object interactions in one turn. But I'll allow fair, you to fair, sacrifice fair, a bonus fair. action to do the second one. So object interaction is your interact with the bag of holding to whip the fucking gunpowder out, and then your bonus action would hmm. be to just like place it on the ground. Oh, shit. Bro. Hey. Yeah. Why? Oh, I do. Ooh, okay, thank god. I was I thought I didn't have a fire like thing to use. Did I set it off for a second? I got a little worried. Fucking broken. use the fucking thing on your furnace hammer. The fucking Yeah, but then I'm standing on top of it. Oh well. Oh well. <laughs> I mean it's not Oh well. Okay. So just, um the last thing we see of Jax is just his hat fucking spiraling to space. It's like oh okay. <laughs> <just> like... <laughs> Woo! It's like a Beyblade, bro. Just yeah. spins off. It's like, uh, what's his name? Uh, what's combat? It's a Kung Lao that has a fucking hat. With fucking Raiden. Raiden. Oh, Kung Lao uses the hat as like a weapon, right? Like, oh, yeah. Does he? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Raiden has so the, the rice hat, though. You know. Right. I mean, Raiden does also use it as a weapon as well. But... Yeah, I thought, uh, yeah, like Raiden, like the thing about Raiden is Raiden going, like, 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 when he like fucking flies yeah. towards someone. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. In Mortal Kombat 2. I think he does it in all Mortal Kombat. That's just the same. You guys just see Jack pull out his fucking bucket of gunpowder. We all have a flashback to Brooks putting on grenades. We're just all like... <laughs> Drop it on the ground. Okay. It's like, oh. And then I'm going to move... I have an opportunity to attack you. You're going to take two, You're going to call two attacks from team, yeah. Well. 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 Um, well. Fuck. Mm. Oh. Or do I just take the fucking bucket to the face, dude? I mean, the bucket might be safer. You can action disengage, right? Yeah, but then I can't let it on fire, right? Fucking, fucking driver again. Oh shit! Yeah, you're right. Oh, okay. This is what I'll do. I will drop the gunpowder where I'm at, okay. and then I'm gonna. Swing at the hag in Which front. One? Same one I hit the the bottom okay. one. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, bottom from my direction. I, it doesn't really matter which one I hit, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Um, I just need to make sure that this does work in fact the way I'm thinking it works. Mobile feet real quick. Uh, yeah. Okay, I don't have to hit. So the first mm -hmm. tack, it's oh my god. Okay, even with my only like plus six to hit. Uh, 24. Hits. Six, 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 six. Four. Uh. Oh, it's also lowered now, too. It's 
damage. Um, 18 points of damage again. Man, you are consistently. It would have been 20, but I lost my plus two to it, or <laughs> I lost two of it from my strength dropping. Mm -hmm. Oh, true. The second to hit is 21. Yep. Oh nice. It's so good. I'm loving this. I, For... I thought. Oh my god, I should say. <laughs> say 18 again, I dare you. Four plus 11 mm. plus two, 17. Oh, okay. <laughs> There you go, one fair different. Enough, fair enough, fair enough. Okay. And then, because I have my mobile feet, I'm gonna go hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity, hippity, hippity hop. hop. Okay. Hippity hop. And then I'm gonna end my turn. All right, so you drop the bucket of gunpowder right there. Nope. Like hit this hag twice, and then book it. Yeah. All right, Davian. Okay. Up. Oh, that's me. Fuck uh, up. Navian, you could ignite the bucket. Now, is is Elazarin still? No, you possessed? look at that at, at Elazarin, and you definitely see that he has his like wits back. He's instantly. Uh, I think it's like I hit you, and I go, "Oh, yeah, God, pretty God, much." I'm sorry. so sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <Okay>. Sorry. <laughs> Ooh. Like, it's like, the, oh my God, look, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean look, it. Looks at the blade. Looks at Davian. Like, ooh. <laughs> now, okay, yeah, with how man. these hags are, if mm -hmm. I were to pass a lightning bolt. Sorry. But like this, would it hit all three of them? Um, is it a five foot yeah. wide type beat? Yeah. Yeah. Then technically yes. All right, here I come. I am sending one. What's the save then? To is it a new? Wait, let me just. Are they in a line? Are they in a line? This gonna be my main game. Stop. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's a DC 15 dex save. Yo, that's lightning. Lightning ignites a bucket. It's my face. It does actually, yeah. Yeah, yeah. and like nice flammable objects. It so ignites flammable. Little flammable. Hmm. That's what I was gonna use. Hell yeah. They fail. Yeah. I'll them. His nice. eyes are all up, like, casino. <laughs> Ma do do you remember, it's 10d6. Yes, to... yeah, 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 I'm just, uh... Oh my god, and they also <laughs> failed to save for the gunpowder. Um, Soko, can you roll me 7d6? Yeah! Oh, okay, hell yeah, bro. Hell yeah, Let's bro. Go. Bro, I will fucking come. Sorry. Sorry. I'm gonna go. 10... I'm rolling like shit. I think same. 31. 31 points of lightning um, damage? Of lightning damage, yeah. Sick. Um, 18? I'm just kidding. Uh, 26. Yeah. That's math. Uh, what did you roll, Soko? Uh, 26. Okay. So, you shoot the lightning bolt, zapping all three of them, and you can suddenly see the bucket of uh, gunpowder that is resting at the feet of these two closer hags just <sharp inhale> begins to light up, and after a few seconds, just <sharp inhale> explodes. Um, for the next <laughs> round, uh, there is just this radius of 30 feet of just bright light emanating from this bucket, and you can see oh, yeah. <laughs> that these two closer hags, they look bloody uh yeah. singed by the lightning uh the closest one the one that like, closest to jacks like partially on fire like they are they do not look bits of fucking bucket in them <laughs> bits of just shrapnel of the bucket yeah shrapnel yeah, yeah, yeah. uh the yeah they don't fine. look too great okay just the gunpowder blow up the bucket's fine mm -hmm. i'm gonna run stop grabbing the ruler there we go I'm gonna run back behind it. No, no. No. On top of the tree? No. What's up? Hold, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. There he goes. There we go. Have you got that much movement? You uh, climbed that entire tree and back. It's crazy. I don't know, actually. Wait, 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 wait. Because I was. 
Oh god, this is hard. Yeah. When I, <laughs> when I, when I, so I was here. So yeah. five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. No, I don't. I can't. I, I have no movement to move back. Okay. Um. um yeah. 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 But now they're gonna kill me. <laughs> we will. I was like here, right? Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, right yeah. there. Okay. Uh, okay. Then. Uh, Onu needs to make a Constitution saving throw. For being in the. He's You're gonna need to make a Constitution saving throw in a minute, mate. Okay. <laughs> um. Bro, you're in Comstock range. Mm, mm, no, fourteen. 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 Not enough. And Duke's been practicing. Uh, Ono takes 28 points of piercing damage. Fuck you now. From the bugs, just. Yeah. Or Onu. Bugs. Is Onu still alive? Yeah. Onu's still alive. Like sure is sure not gonna fucking fly away from these bugs. Cut that bugs. Mm -hmm. I'm I gonna say gonna, that. I, um, I wanna get that bug. Even though Ono is like, you know, the difficult terrain stems from flying creatures, that even though Ono is flying, it will still be affected by difficult terrain. But that's still. Because he has to, like, fly yeah, exactly. through them and they're still impeding him. But that shouldn't matter. Ono can still get out of the. Fringe DM. Boom. Point. Well, I moved out of it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Special Dutch hates mm. animals. Fetch turn? Uh. I will use my bonus action. To have Onu take the evade action. Or oh, the dodge action, sorry. Okie dokie. Yeah. Now, this Emerald Sister's turn um, is going to just like it. for free drop concentration on Insect Plague because there's no one in there anymore and she can't move it. So instead, she's going to cry and run away. Mm -hmm. Guys, I'm scared. <laughs> the more Dutch reads, the more I get nervous. Right, like that's a lot of text. Because I'm assuming these are coven hags, and they have like so much more shit than like a regular hag, and I, I'm terrified. Um, okay, you won't like what plot comes no. next. Oh, don't say that. You know, you could just let us go with like a warning, you know? Maybe <laughs> a, like, a warning. ticket. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. That does sound real fun. How is your weekend, Cuevo? Yeah, she's going to cast Polymorph on herself. Uh oh! Cool. Oh, I've, can, seen my, I've seen this one before. She can turn into a creature equal to a CR of 10 or less. New form can be... That's literally every beast. Any beast whose challenge rating is equal or less in target, so... Oh, 10. I hate it. Which is literally any beast that you want. So... <laughs> Bunny wrap it! Bunny well, I'm, I'm not seeing anything else, but... But it's it's like the bunny the rabbit from Monty, Monty Python. Python though. Yeah. <laughs> Go! Uh, That's the one from Wallace and Gromit, the fucking were rabbit. The like, were rabbit. Which. Oh. She is going to. Uh, it's like a T Rex. Oh, it's gonna be a T Rex, bro. Yeah, turn to a T Rex. Oh, I missed Trim. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. This makes me miss Trim. I just T Rex right back. And we'd have a kaiju believe, battle. Right, yes. So they are. this. Uh, lovely lady. <laughs> Turn your armor into a T Rex. Uh, hold on. Done. Yeah, I'll, I'll just alter shape of the armor for funsies just to have a dinosaur head for no reason at all. Oh my god, Mecha Godzilla? <laughs> <laughs> but like, Yo, someone fun. cast enlarge? No, for uh, real. I could become a robo dinosaur, cast enlarge, and I change my shape, and then my slam attack becomes a bite attack as a dinosaur. I, mean, I, I think I can actually cast. We can make this happen. Prepared. We can do this. Let me check my spell. Like cheap, but I'm pretty sure I can. We can rebuild him. We have. Oh, maybe I actually don't get that spell. That's crazy. What in large case? 
Yeah, I don't get large reduces in alchemist uh, or as a artificer. You probably oh, I do. I do. I do. I do. I do. I do. Hmm? I do. The alphabet's hard. Oh my yeah. god! Turns yourself into a T Rex. That's her turn. Oh, she didn't even move. Hell yeah. Me go, me go. So I'm going to fucking. Don't forget to move the dome with you. Yeah, I... I'm gonna. Well, I want to see where, what that does to the dome. What was, what, what does to the dome? He moves, like moving. Just putting it centered on him. I can't move the dome because it's such a dome. It's okay. I'm in it now. Uh, hmm. And Davian's in it. Just not just move into it, probably. What? Let me just oh, look at something real quick. You're, you're fine. If you keep the dome there, I'll be in it next turn. No, no, no. It's not that dome I'm worried about. <laughs> oh, it's that dome I'm about to give you. Yeah, <laughs> yes, uh, Hold up. Wait a minute. That's the after hours. Sorry, are we oh, on the wrong oh, website? My bad, my bad. No, it's, uh, it's fine. Uh, yeah, so I will, as an action, I'll cast Circle of Power. Oh. oh. Okay, is that same okay. size? Same, yeah, same size. Okay. Right. Um, so everyone has advantage on saving throws against spells and magical effects. Nice. If we succeed on the saving throw and it makes us take half damage, it's zero. Huge. Uh, oh, and then... It won't work for Laura. Yeah. Uh, and then as a bonus action, I will just drink a regular potion of healing. <laughs> Wait, is that all you have? Yeah. Oh Bro, you should have asked. I couldn't give it. Yeah. Uh, it it kind of do be like, I thought I had more, but I remembered I've been like, I don't fucking need them. Someone else can have them. Because I'll just, like, do mass healing all the time. <sighs> cool. That's a six. <clears throat> it's 2d4 plus 2, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah cool. I rolled two ones, so. That's where we're at. That is my turn, and I get. Oh, excellent. 12 temporary hit points. Man, am I about to shit on you, bro? Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, you see this, like, <laughs> even more holy power come out for me. I'm just sort of standing in front of him, like, oh, God! <laughs> yeah. Oh, um, is that your turn? Yes, sir. This Emerald Sister is going to uh -oh. use a fifth level spell slot to cast this spell. Wait, magic. your temporary hit points, Quiva. Yeah, no, 12. So oh, she dispels okay. your circle of power. It's because she's casting it at fifth level. <laughs> Fucking bitch! <laughs> what a dick! Um, and that is her action, though. I hate it. And that is also her turn. Oh, oh what a bitch. <clears throat> Every time I've used circle power, it has lasted less than one turn. <laughs> <laughs> It, um, it never makes it out of out of use. <laughs> and this one's going to close the gap towards you, Laszlo, and is going to oh, multi-attack. Multi uh, two claw attacks. Oh, they didn't even care that I did that. Okay. I think it was fuck. Yeah, because I'm. Uh, first one well, is a can't keep 25 aggro. to hit. Second one is a nine to hit. Uh, well, nine misses. The, the, the twenty billion hits. Take 13 points of slashing damage. Okay. And I need you to make a constitution saving throw. Uh, that's a 13. Your strength is reduced by 4. Again, I wrote another 4. Ooh. Bro, they can, oh, they can kill us like that, too. You yes, can. If your strength yes, gets below can. a certain number, you die. Strength hits 0, Bro. you're dead. Because <laughs> you don't have, basically, it's like you don't have enough strength to hold up your own head and your neck. That means without the gauntlets, okay. three hits and I would lose. Or I, uh, I'd be dead. Uh, two hits and I'm down because I'm now down to four. Oh, right, you're at eight. Yeah. Wait. Well, it's oh, a D4, dead. right? Like, I just happened to roll four twice. So, like, yeah. it's not No, I know, two, but, like, yeah. potentially. Who is the minute? Who is the minute? What's, what's the number you have to hit to. It, it's less than five? Less than four? No, no, the number is zero. 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 Oh, as long as you have one strength, you're still alive. strength is dead. Oh, How oh, the okay. fuck do you change your modifier? Yeah. Okay, I found it. You know, over, like, I like, found it. Write a note to yourself. Well, the no, worst. Yeah. Uh, uh, that is her score. turn. In the meantime, uh, Dagon. You're up. Hey, um, Alazarin, you're looking real bad, right? Oh, yes, sir. And you're within thirty feet now, so I'm gonna bonus action. Uh, or no, I'm gonna action sympathetic mending on Alazarin. Uh, did not roll as good as I did for Jax, but That's you get fine. um thirteen. Hit points. Hey, I'll take it. 
Yeah. And then my bonus action, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna leave my body and I'm gonna try and possess the dinosaur. <laughs> I wanna be a dinosaur, bitch. Okay. So she has to make a charisma. Get off the floor. Yes. Everybody do the dinosaur. What am I saying? I'm sure she's gonna have a shitty Christmas eat it I because, really you know, hags, spellcasters, but I don't know. 16. Rust makes the save. That's the DC. Oh, well. Charisma is their second time. Almost like he cheated. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Pardon? He okay. has access to the character sheets. He can see what your save is. Um, and Don't what's my mobile. temp HP before my turn? <laughs> uh, Koiba, what's my temp HP before my turn? Oh. Uh, 17. Dude, like, Thank I did you. my research, by the way, because I was like, wait, yeah. can I dispel magic the dome? But you can't. You cannot dispel... It's an ability, not a spell, right? Yeah, so... well, the thing is, the writing of the spell magic says spell... Magical effect. Or magical effect, and then it goes on and talks in, like, spell yeah. levels. Oh, so not magical effects, just spells. Yeah, God, thanks just spells, yeah. Okay. Yeah, because there's like there's some magical effects that aren't a spell, but if it replicates another spell, yeah, exactly. Yeah. You like, use that like if, level. If the source of the magic isn't inherently a spell, then you're good. Gotcha. Well, that's my turn. Okie dokie. Jax. Hey, uh, dude, I keep like I don't know, man. I've lost the plot. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't know, man. I lost the plot. It's gonna be my like, main. I, I, I don't. I don't even know what to do anymore. Hit them. Yeah, but Hard. It, like, I don't do that very well. Fast <clears throat> reduce and make the T Rex tiny, and then it can't hurt as much. <laughs> I think it only reduces it by like a D4, and I don't have it prepared. Well, yeah, I'm sorry. Um, at, uh, there is it. Perfectly a five foot gap between those guys. That really sucks. Uh, all right. I'm just gonna go doot doot, and I'm gonna shoot. Doot doot, and I'm gonna shoot. Lightning bolt. Oh my god! Don't right through the motherfuckers. Fucking hell! All right. All I right. Deck save, brother. My god. Uh, low, the highest is fifteen. Well, they had to be a twenty. So. <clears throat> Nice. Uh, uh, that's uh eight d six. Back. For 37 points of lightning damage. 37 points. Sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Alright, um... And I am in dome now, right? Bond set. Okay. Made a move anymore. So, um, this... Hag... Dies. You, you zap her and she just... <laughs> drops to the ground. And as you Yay. do that, you just hear the other two hags. Just, well, the one hag and the T-Rex. Uh, the hag just, just, <laughs> just goes, no! And the T-Rex just begins to roar, roar loudly. So loud that the trees around you begin to shake. Um, I... What else would you like to do? Uh, I'll move another 10 feet to get in melee here. On. And then for my bonus action, I am going to drink, drink. a potion of greater healing. That's pretty corpus. Ew. That's 14 points of healing. I almost just did damage on my sheet. Oh no, don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Uh, and that's, that, that is my turn. Oh, and you get... Uh, fucking, I could find a fucking D6 to pick up. Mm. Uh, you get, uh, 14 temporary hit points. Hell yeah, brother. No. Um. 
¿ok? Está bien. I'd like to cast Cold Monster on Ooh. the T-Rex. Ok. Like, I like this. Uh... Mm -hmm. Does the does Regardless, the T-Rex roll with the Hag's wisdom? It rolls with the Hag's wisdom. Mental stats are the Hag's. It's like a druid. Yeah. Polymorph is very much like a druid wild shit. In that regard. Because I thought Polymorph this... wasn't, because other things like when they polymorph they have to use the creatures, but this is specific to the Hag's. No. Because in the past, that's what makes Druid Wild Shape unique was when you polymorph, they have to use the creature's intellectual, like, mental stats as well. Hmm. Make polymorph is... Mm, hold on. Because, like, I'm also remembering like, Critical Role when they made Jester into a moth, and then Jester had no thoughts except Curtain Good. Sun Bad. Like, because they had to use the moth stats because she wasn't a druid. Oh, yeah, never mind. The, the target's game statistics, including mental. My bad, my bad. So yeah. it does use the, the T-Rex mental Aha! stats. All right. T-Rex, oh, yeah. big dub. Whole monster, please. Wisdom, Wisdom saving throw. Because that's why Druid Wild Shape is great. Probably oh, natural 20. <laughs> oh, no. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. You're not sorry? No, I am. I can feel the that's pain. That's why being a spellcaster sucks, man. I can, I can feel the pain. and uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. I'm so <laughs> I'm sorry, kidding. dude. Okay. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a touch. <laughs> uh... I'm so sorry, man. I'm so sorry, dude. Oh god. Onu, Onu is gonna swoop in and attack this hag. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Where is Hank? He's not. He's not gonna fucking hit it at all. <laughs> no. Oh. Wait. Oh my god. No, he almost. I almost net twenty, but it was a two plus nine. <laughs> um. So eleven. No. <laughs> no. All right. I'm so okay. sorry, dude. Wait, does Ono oh. get multiple attacks now? No. Isn't that like a level 11 feature, though? Am level I crazy? 11. <laughs> 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 he is unfortunately crazy. No, I'm not. I s bro, I'll, I will almost bet that that's your level 11 feature as a ranger. <coughs> I can take an extra attack. Yeah, but Duke isn't a fully level 11 ranger. And Oh, his... right, he's a f uh, right, He's a multi-class. And his right. attacks now count as magical. Yeah, the right. of I thought you were full of love and range. Non magical attacks and damage. You forget the whole, his entire first, first like, first. Bro, his multi class doesn't even matter, honestly. Like. Okay. okay. I just fireballed and then lightning bolted three From hands. From a staff of power. Yeah, but if he wasn't. That I am warlock. using because I am a warlock. I could, you I couldn't use I it know. if I wasn't a warlock. You're fucking stupid, dumb, American That's... man. Look, you've set him off now. It's okay, you set him off. You set him off. <laughs> uh, is that your turn, Duke? Uh, I'm just taking. I'm just taking this out. At least my spells were a piece of shit. Yeah, that's my bad. <laughs> my bad, Ken. Um, um, anything you, else? You also get 14 no. temp HP there. Just have a T-Rex turn. Yeah. <laughs> and the T-Rex is going to. I'm going to sleep. <laughs> I'm at Jax. That's rude. I love the oh my god, when you put it down, it shakes. It walks, yeah, wait, Dutch, yeah. move it with your arrow keys real quick. Just to watch the ground shake each step. Boom. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Whoa, that's inside me. <laughs> hey, that's uh, what she said. Um, because you just killed. It ceased to. Uh, like... I was gonna make a claw. Uh, no, a, a bite and a tail attack. Ah! I'm in both. Their arms are too small to really have yeah, good claw exactly. attacks. Uh, the bite is a 25 no to hit. <laughs> huh? 25 to hit, I said. <laughs> that even hits Jax. This motherfucker. I hate, I hate that he actually said it again, too. Yeah, this That's motherfucker the worst waiting for a response when he knows the answer. This bitch looks at our character sheets a week ago. Oh, Jukes. 
Well, I just assume 25 hits any one of you, you know? You know, okay. my goal is to get to the shield spell with my fucking next level. Please. And I'm going to use it so I have like a 28 AC. Oh, good. You take 23 points of piercing damage. Sick, dude. You are now considered <laughs> grappled because you are what the in its mouth. Uh -oh. Um, Which makes you also restrained in this case. Cool. Which means it's going to have to pick a different target for the tail attack. So it's going to continue moving with Jax in mouth. In its mouth. <laughs> like moving here. And oh, hey, like slap the Lazarin with a how? tail. That's kind of funny. 23 to hit? It's just hits. <laughs> I'm rolling the wrong dice. Hold. Twenty-eight points of bludgeoning damage as the steel just uh -oh. slams into you. Conscious. Oh. Uh, and it is now your turn. Hell yeah. How close are you? Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Did... Close. <laughs> close. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'm just. Hours. No, not this time. I will uh, mask your wounds there. Ooh, we love that. On everybody. Everybody. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> cool, I'm rolling like shit. So I roll 3d8, right? No. For, for, no, for Massacre Wounds. Yeah, I rolled a 9 on the dice. Oh my god. Oh you my suck. God. I rolled yeah. 1, 3, and 5. Yeah, Jesus. it's kind of. So we get 9 total? No, no, you get 14. Oh. Everyone gets 14. It's the same. Does that I include Onu? Yes, that does include Onu. Because it's creatures. Everyone gets 14. Guys, that's the same I rolled for my mass healing word at the start of this fucking fight. Yep. Mm -hmm. And I spent a higher level spell slot on this one. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Body right I will, right. as a bonus action, kill myself. Okay. No, sorry, that's not on there. No, sorry, sorry that's, a, that's an action. Sorry. Uh, in game. I mean, your case, you're pretty weak. That's probably a free action, if anything. Objective uh, <laughs> fucking, yeah, true. Four strength in a fucking dream, you know what I mean? Just like. Uh, what Good thing your taxi's dex. Yeah, actually, yeah. <laughs> I just think it's a fucking anything I can do here. Probably not. Nope. Uh, yeah, cool. We're pretty useless at this point. That's my turn. Fine. We're just uh, health pools waiting to die. At least, at least I get sixteen temporary hit points. Mm. Yeah. More than I okay. fucking just hit myself for. Um. All right. This hag is going to. Uh, put her hand on your shoulder. Yeah, go. Or attempt to. No. No, no, no. <clears throat> no, never mind. Put your hand on your shoulder. Good thing uh, she can't reach me. And cast Contagion. Oh. Ew. I you fuck ready. off. I need you to make no. a constitution saving throw. Yeah, a no. boy. No. See, I know what Contagion does, and that's so fucked. That's actually so fucked up. That's me. fucked up. Do that to me. <laughs> No need. Oh, dirty 20. Oh. <gasps> He's done it. And that's her turn. That's done, yeah. Dragon. Fuck yeah, okay. Um, all nothing, baby. I'm gonna use my last sympathetic mending on a Lazarin. Oh. Thanks. Uh, you regain. Oh, that's so shit. Uh, you get 10 hit points. Oh shit, I just did it as damage. No! At 20, at 20. No! No, 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 because it just took out my temporary hit points, so I just need to have oh. my temp back in. And I will. So I'm just um, hitting the damage button, bro. Leave the body and uh, bonus action and just as I'm heading over there. I, as I'm rushing over and the healing energy is hitting a Lazarin, be like, I'm coming in! And I'm gonna hitchhike with a Lazarin. Who were you, who were you previously hitchhiking with? No one. I tried to do the dinosaur, and they right. made the save. Right, right, right. Tried yeah. to do the dinosaur. <laughs> okay. 
I could do is the dinosaur. Like those books at Stormcrow. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's my turn. Right. Jax. That was a revelation I don't need. Um, <laughs> dinosaur on dinosaur. Love. Like Duke Red DLD. From the Not the dinosaur baby. loving dinosaur. Daddy lover, hmm? Oh? Oh? Daddy lover Domino's pizza. Okay. <laughs> so... Grapple, right? Uh, I'm restrained. Ooh. But yeah, oh, daddy. so not anymore. I'm gonna bonus action Misty Step. Okay. Ooh. Misty Step to where? Go. Oh. Okay. Um... Stuck in your head now, Duke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and now I can't get the spell that I wanted to. Um, so I'm going to drop the hammer. Drop the bamo. And I'm punching the dinosaur. You want me to put the hammer down? Okay, the first punch is a uh eleven? Eleven? Oh, Baby. No, no, it's not hit. No, no, we're not doing that here. <laughs> Sorry, I draw the line. <laughs> I've... Uh, how about a 22? That hits. Okay. Oh. He takes... Ooh, max damage, bro. Let's fucking go. 13 points of thunder damage. <laughs> and has disadvantage to hit anyone but me. Ah, that's funny. Um, this is this gonna hit me anyways? No. Oh. She's Bro, concentrating, even though she's a dinosaur, she's still concentrating on Polymorph. <laughs> and I will oh, natural one on the right. concentration uh, check. So <laughs> you punch the dinosaur, and suddenly... <laughs> as the concentration oh, yeah, drops. <clears throat> so T-Rex gone. <laughs> Woo! I did it, guys! Real, real, real. Weep, weep. Um, and I already used my bonus section, so nope, that's it. I'm gonna throw my... Mm. No, I'm not, actually. Snap my staff of power. Mm. <laughs> Snap my wiener of my leg. Oh, yeah. wiener. Uh, God. <laughs> you know? Man's grows 10 inches. A couple of sessions ago, and suddenly. True, he did do. That. I forgot about that. I did grow <laughs> ten inches. It, it was um, everywhere. About a foot taller. Horse where it counts. That's, that's the morals campaign. The teeth. Wait, that's not. No, wait. Which one was no, it? No, centaur. Was that? That's uh, the fucking mm, the other fucking. Law. Is that the one? Law at the end. No, oh, no. Hey, you one more, you know. No. Uh... <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Minotaur. Minotaur. Can I? Just for, just for giggles, because I don't even think I've used it yet. Hmm? Can I run around... Uh, well, actually, let me let me keep count here. 5, 10, 15... Oh, 20? 20? 25. Uh, diagonal, yeah, 20, yeah. Because the diagonal... 25, 30, and then and then 35. Just wait, wait, let me just check this real quick. Okay, no, I that I'm still I'm still here. Because okay. they're both within 10 feet of me, right? Yeah. And I'm gonna cast Arms of Hadar. Oh shit! At check uh, level. Arms. So so we're gonna have a strength saving throw. Please. Is that everyone within 10 feet of you? <laughs> Why is Jackson 10 feet of me? Yeah. Okay, it's then okay. I'm here. Okay, well, is Jackson no, 10 fine. feet of me here? Okay. Uh, Strength save? Motherfucker, dude. I rolled a 12 at the highest. Alright, they both fail. Fucking uh... 2d6 necrotic damage. Huh? And they can't take reactions uh, until the next turn. Oh, wow. Wow. Wait, I'm casting at second level, though. So I roll another d6. 3d6 necrotic damage. 3 necrotic damage. 
for nine. <laughs> eh, that's that's like almost half. Nine points of necrotic damage, and they mm -hmm. can't take reactions okay. until the next turn. Uh, is it the start of the next turn or end of the next turn? That just make a fucking difference. It just much. says until it's next turn, honey, honey bun. <laughs> so when they would normally get one back, so it basically just steals their reaction. I was gonna, I was gonna yeah. say, doesn't make a difference because it's one of their turns next. So I'm like, cool. Yeah. Um, <laughs> is that your turn? Uh. No, because the owner's gonna fly back in. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And he's gonna attack this guy. And it misses because that's a. Uh, it says. 13 to hit. Oh, yeah, that misses. I'm doing great, chat. And then he's gonna fly away again. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Okay. Um. Now that's my turn. Whitey. <clears throat> uh, uh, you get uh, 16 temp HP. That's better. Thank you. Oh, did, you never rolled mine. Oh, it's because fucking I forgot. Yours is 12. Why do you hate me? This is 12 because I forgot. Cringe. I didn't um, roll fucking Laura's either. We'll swear it. <laughs> I mean, I thought I had max, so I didn't bother to ask oh, about it. You can see... I have 17, so. Oh, yeah, you got max. This uh, Emerald Sister looks very bloodied, and she's going to use an ability called Invisible Passage. Turn. Invisible. No. And then passage. Pass into the edge. Lazarus. Mm. What to do? What to do? That's what I'm thinking. <clears throat> They even fucking okay, dude. Cool. Just flame strike, you know. I will. Yeah, fuck it. I will cast the invisibility. Okay. Uh. I wish I could do have a way for her to like reveal herself just for you, but I don't. Um, but she is currently. Okay. That's where she. Okay. I will. Bitch, fucking went to a tree, like just up a tree. Oh, it's kind of funny. Uh, I'll just like point at that where I see her and just be like, she's up there. Is she in the tree? Oh, she the oh wait, what the fuck? Oh. Yeah, it's like she's in the fucking. Tree. Yeah, I was like, like wait, she climbed a tree. That's sick, bro. No, <laughs> like, that's fucking. Forward. Stupid, uh, it's on the ground level. Stupid, stupid height. Stupid tree. Stupid so she's on the ground. Okay, I'll just say she's by that tree then. She's by uh, that tree. Well, she's actually like, why is it so high up? Chill, bruh. Right here. Okay, cool. Yeah. yeah. Right here. Right I'll there. I'll just be like, she's by those bushes. I'm by capping. Tree. Oh my god, I'm driving myself up the wall. Bro. Bro? <laughs> Where the fuck she is? I, I just point to there and go, that's yeah, gamers, so that's <laughs> rise up. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, and then, so this one doesn't have its reactions, right? Uh, yes. Fucking, just get the fuck out of there for a bit, you know what I mean? Okay. okay. Dang. Oh, no. And that is much. Turn. All right. Turn uh, like this emerald Dude. sister is going to look at you all. Um and just without saying anything, picks up the corpse of her sister and begins casting a spell and well, she's a no, maybe someone's kind of spell. She's attempting to cast uh, teleport. No, the imposing counter spell is uh, cast. 
she then disappears. Um, the other one, Laszlo, you know where she is, so I'm gonna just let mm -hmm. combat roll out until it's turn again. But this one is completely gone. Equation. Dragon. Um, so I'm still hitchhiking with a Lazarin right now. Hold on. Wanna, I guess I'll do, like, invoke smite, but what's... We've been mostly been attacking with lots of magic and, like, improvised weapons. No <laughs> one's been, like, using a main weapon, right? Well, you saw me use uh, it once, my well, main weapon once, oh, against Davian. Davian. Yeah, yeah, that's me. not yeah. helpful. Um, I mean, I guess since a Lazarin, I don't know if it's gonna do anything. I hope it knows where she is. I don't have anything else to do. I'll go ahead and just use an Invoke Smite and your Dragon Sword will start glowing with the ghosty energy. Hell yeah. Is that your turn? That's my turn. Yep. Oh, I see. Dax. Yeah. Um... Five. Mm-hmm. And I uh, swing my fees. With disadvantage because she is invisible. Yep. So a natural one's gonna hit her, right? No. Okay. And for the second one. And you really got rid of a natural twenty touch. No. My bad, man. Not cringe, bro. You're the Kinda one trying cringe. to hit an invisible lady, so who's really to blame? I just like hitting women. Sorry. Okay. okay. Cool. Excellent. Right. Open and ship it. Clip and ship it. Clip it, guys. It's been uh, 19. That hits. Or seven points of thunder damage. Seven points of thunder damage. Okay. Is that your turn? Yeah. Does that make her uninvisible? Not new. Davian. Yeah. If I say he's an invisibility to do that. I. Yeah, you don't see any of the hags, but you do know that Elazarin pointed out that where that little half dome is is where the invisible hag is currently. Um. So I can't, but I can't see them. Correct. She is invisible. Can I attempt to perceive her? Um, you can only do that. I think you have to true sight or some shit. No, true sight, you can just always oh, see true. them. Uh, an invisible creature is impossible to see without the aid of magic or a special sense. Uh, I'm a special boy. Does that give me a special sense? No. In that case, can I cast? Entangle. Um, let me see. It's a twenty foot square, so I would cast like Wait, what? Oh. Yeah, it's oh. on the tree. It's on the tree. Yeah, I have the same fucking issue. <clears throat> 20 foot, so five tiles like this way. And then. Oh, dang it! And then f and then five tiles that way, so. Now it's gone in the tree again. No, you're fine, but I. I yeah, no, you're good, you're good. You're good. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. Uh, so she made strength save. Yeah. And fail, so she is restrained. So she can move. Cool. Am I in the fucking tree again? Like, what's... You are in the tree again. Uh... Oh my god. <laughs> um... Get out of the... I'm sorry. Okay, I'm good. I'm... It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> she's restrained. Yes, she's restrained. Uh... Alright, anything else? Just, just to make notes of it, because she's restrained, technically have a normal attack roll against her. 
strained advantage on Visibility disadvantage against each other. Interesting. Yes, okay. Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. And uh, Oni's going to attack for uh, 16. Is... Onu really letting me down today. Aww. Not again. <laughs> really <laughs> letting me down Our today. Penis is going to come back. <laughs> yeah, it's been a really good ride, and this man is suddenly starting to be like, you <laughs> fucking piece of shit, what's going right. on that for us? Oh, actually, wait, I'll stay here. Actually, no, no way. Okay. Okay. Your turn? Please. That's my turn. Attempt to use an action to break the restraint. Fails, and that is her turn. Elijah. Nice. Uh, yeah, in this same For you, space. because you see invisibility, your attack rolls would have yeah. advantage. Ooh. She looking bloody, or...? And yeah. you have oh, my, yeah. the, the invoke smite on your sword if you attack well, with it. Well, I can't super, get there. Super far away. I'm oh, giga, well. giga far away. Well, then. I will move 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30 feet back. <laughs> uh, yeah, and fuck it. I'll just, I'll, I'll hit a guiding bolt. Okay. With advantage. Mm -hmm. Because, of course, why, why would I roll anything higher than a 10? That'd be crazy. <laughs> Does a does a sixteen hit? Oh. Cool. Darn. Cool. Really wish I helpful. really wish I did my other plan of using fairy fire. Mhm. Mm but then I was like, ah, oh, I can hit with adva advantage plus nine. I can't miss. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's Wait. my turn. Advantage oh. plus nine. Is mm. roll a ten, right? You no, I said, I, no, no, I rolled a six and a seven. I said I can't oh. roll anything above a ten. Uh, right. right. Okay, okay, okay. Their turn? Yeah, sir. Diagon. One step we'll close to the edge. Stay, uh, stay with the Lazarin, but this time we'll send the Invoke Smite to Jax's gauntlets, I guess. Corn, 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 corn. That's me. Because I'm basically here in case a reaction is needed to protect a Lazarin. <laughs> Jax. My turns are real I fast. <laughs> just took a bite of my Oreo. <laughs> How dare you? While you're chewing, I was looking up because um, the the CNE is happening right now, the Canadian exhibition in Toronto, mm -hmm. and the half reason to go is they have a list of weird foods every year that vendors do. This year, one of the weird foods is deep fried Oreos with pickles. Uh, why, why the pickles, man? Pickles. I don't know. Is just interesting. To, to make it weird, because it's a CNE. Anyways, you're done chewing now. You're good. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's just a straight roll, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh -oh. Second hit. <laughs> First one miss. I go cry. Okay. Oh. I roll a two and a three. So. All right. Is that your turn? My invoke smite wasted. Thanks, Koiba. Uh, is that your turn, buddy? Yeah, I mean, I, I don't know what else I would do. All right, Dalian. Back to you. I'm still oh. in the same spot. God damn it. We Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Last one. I Just hit her with up. my sword. Oh. Um. Um, 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 um. Um, 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 um. 25 to hit. Yeah. <clears throat> Come on, I'm going to give in the invoked smite. <laughs> Wham. Yeah. Wham. Wham. Uh, six points of magical slashing damage and one point of cold damage. Okay. And then I. Does she have to. Is there a concentration check or anything she has to do now? Or? Uh, no. Well, then I'll swing again. Dirty 20. It's. Be enough. God, duh! <laughs> Four points of magical slashing damage and two points of cold damage. Sad. 
You rolled 13 points total, right? Six and seven? Yeah. How do you want to finish her off? Oh, oh, okay. oh yes. I'm gonna just be I'm gonna just be swinging and slashing at the at the yeah. <laughs> air in front of me until she becomes visible, indicating that she is no longer alive. Mm -hmm. Yes, and as you do that, this carved up corpse remains, and you can see it kind of beginning to disintegrate Ew. into these like this this like large group of these decayed looking moths, and they just kind of. Yeah. Flutter away, uh, but she does leave oh, some stuff dude. behind. Um, you see, in the spot where she previously died, in a small black box, uh, roughly three feet, three, three feet each side, uh, as well as a ring, on top of it. Are they magical? Uh, both items seem to be magical. Both the box and the ring. Yes. I will spend my time to identify them. Okay. If I'm assuming we're probably just gonna see here. I don't know, it's up to you guys. Yeah. We need like. I would assume we're short resting in general, so. Yeah, probably. Yeah, probably. <laughs> okay. Identifying uh, the ring. It is a deal maker's ring. Okay. And that is an item I made in D and D Beyond. You can add it to your bounce to class. Okay. 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 Makers are right. be able to find it, it should be, uh... Yeah, I'm just writing a bit of my inventory. Mm -hmm. uh, a silver piece has been pressed and shaped into this magic ring. A pair of outstretched hands reach across the surface of the ring towards the center. When you make a charisma deception or persuasion check with another humanoid and offer out your hand for a handshake, wow. then roll a d4 and add the number rolled to the ability check. Once this property has been used, it can't be used again until the next dawn. That's, That's cool. Uh, we've all heard the saying, don't make a deal with the devil. But in reality, making a deal with the hag is far worse. Legend has mm. it that some specific hags, native to the Feywild, once struck a deal with a goddess, which is why the Feywild is now such a chaotic place. Interesting. That's cool. That's dope. That's a fun tidbit. The lore tidbits. Mm. Well, I really enjoy it, adding the little lore, like, mm -hmm, spin yeah. spin things in items. Dark Souls. Really yeah. I'm just kind of figuring out what to put without, giving, lore. without giving too much away, but giving you guys enough to kind of get you guys... Get a little bit of lore. A little bit of lore going. going. Yeah. Uh, the box. Let me quickly double check. I did it lick with the back. Uh, dude, I told him, dude. I'm gonna get laid. What is happening? I don't know. <laughs> Big times is <laughs> the, the box fuck? by Roddy Rich. <laughs> living in a box by living in a box by living. Man in a box by Alice in Chains. The man in a box. Bam. Um, Bam. Bam. Get what fucking book. Book. Being driven since the 80s. Take a look in a book. Reading Rainbow. Oh. Uh, it just It's just called a hag's box uh oh. it's not an item in the beyond but oh. um Bad. you do learn that anyone who opens this box uh or just for shits and giggles do you open it this sounds like you know what for shits and giggles i do hold on no 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 you're identifying it. Box. You're identifying I would open it. The box while you're identifying it right okay let me just read yeah, right, identify what's inside the box you learn i want to kind of I'm going somewhere, but you identify it and you learn that it is safe to open. Okay. Yeah, open the box. Uh, you open the box and you find three wooden figures, heavily articulated, modeled after Navigan, Brooks, and Daigon. Ew. Oh, <laughs> oh this oh, could be a it. lot of fun. Okay. And oh, you I know hate it. that if you were to stand these on the ground, 
they would act out insulting parodies of their dupes' recent actions. I am not telling anybody about this. I'm hiding <laughs> those figurines when I open the box, and I am not saying a fucking word. <laughs> so is Davian Brooks in Diagon? Yes. Yep. So just one of like the random, like the random the hag all... items that you get in the Because like, we're short resting monsters. here. We're short resting for an hour. Like, is he gonna what disappear and open the box in secret at some point? Like, yeah, maybe you don't tell us what they do, but we see him it's open the box. You, you just see me identifying stuff. You okay, just see me open yeah. the box. Wouldn't like. So we see you open the box and we see the figures, but we don't know yeah. what they do. Gotcha. You wouldn't see the figures at all either. That's just feeling nosy. I said, what? We're not, we're gonna sit, we'll watch him open the box and close it and not ask what's in it. There's no fucking way. I mean, you guys can ask. I don't. Yeah, I obviously will. Like what? Anything in there? Is it just like a fancy box? So it's called a hag box. Uh, basically, they use it to um, store different pieces that they uh, bargain for from people. So like if you make a bargain and they take something or whatnot, they put it in the box and it like binds the contract. Seems like very specific. They can't just put it in any box. I think it has something to do with how their magic works so i don't really know strange well we don't need it we're not gonna do any hag contracts unless what are you gonna sell it well maybe i can figure out how to access the contracts i, I don't know Might that'd be interesting be maybe you could free someone from a shitty deal if we like or oh, we can crack the make box. our own deals ourselves oh, that's asking for trouble that's that sounds <laughs> shady I mean, Elazrin yeah. already makes deals, but his are like. Well, you to know, be fair, Elazrin did just kill a person too, so. Let's. <laughs> and Davian kind of did too. No. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you did threaten him to just touch wrong. and move a piece. No. Jax. <laughs> Jax. Consider you're the man whose life I was trying to save. By doing such a thing, you are really being a prick about it. I'm just saying. It's not that I'm not. It's not that I'm not grateful. No, uh, you sure? It's the way you went about <laughs> it, though. You were there. You, yeah. you were there, so. And I was told about it. Original. Every, we had the conversation. Tells stories. I mean, you were, you were there when Elijah so killed that the guy. Line. You didn't threaten him to pick up a piece or you'd kill him. You can see Honest, honestly, when you put it that way, <laughs> it almost sounds better than what I did do. Yeah. So. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. You mean to die the hero and live long enough That's to see the yourself joke. become the villain? <laughs> no. <laughs> Jax will probably do something with the box. You know what he's like. Oh, I'm Sell still, since we're short resting, mm -hmm. I'm going to ask the group, so yeah, now for a minute, Daigon's voice coming out of a Lazarus mouth, because I'm still like, so when we, you know, get on the move again, Torn, because it seems like, like, if I leave now, I can't, you know, ride along with the Lazarus for a whole day, but what if I need to help later? But we also, like, we can't leave my body here. Brooks, how do you feel about just dragging it along behind you until I'm forced out of a Lazarus body? If you're not, I'll... Yes, I will. If you're, uh, not. If you're not, I I bloody will, you lazy. Oh. All I do around here is picking up you guys' shit. Why does that sound like something he would respond with? God mm -hmm. damn it. <laughs> yes, right, there, you know. Canonically, since Brooks is in here, until I'm kicked out of a Lazarin or I choose to leave, we're making him drag my body along sure. with us. Benefits of <laughs> him, than, your benefit. He, is, he is our pack meal. Yeah, rather than emptying the bag of holding to put it in there and then having to, yeah, no. Yeah, that's fair. Okay. Because it, it just seems like, it, it just seems a like a waste since I never got to do the thing. Like, you mm -hmm. know. Um, so you guys are short resting? Should we take yeah. a little, little yeah. break here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I'm break. just gonna say I am fucking giga boofed. I know. I mean, I know giga boofed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I know. We're getting to a better, like, natural ending point. Uh, okay. Okay. But, okay. Uh, Dutch has a All stopping right. point in mind. Just quick little well, breaks. So stopping point that I had in mind was further then, but like we could. There's, you know, 
Mm. Fine. Um, yeah, we'll take a, we'll take a quick break here, quickly go for a stretch and all that stuff, and then we'll be back shortly. Cool.
before, and it was just like... <laughs> and I really want to claim your ass! <laughs> All right. There you go. Hey guys, we are back. So, let's just uh, get right into it. You all finish your short rest. If you want to use some hit dice to heal up, you can. I believe some people definitely oh. did. I was full health. <laughs> Say Wait, uh, but I I'm think I can work. use hit dice to heal Onu, maybe. Maybe. Can you? That's cool. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's on hit dice. <clears throat> Boba is just deep throating a fucking rap. Look <laughs> <laughs> at hungry! <laughs> It it's looks like it's just a tortilla. It's just a tortilla. It's not even it's a just wrap. Just a dry tortilla. It's a naked tortilla. Yeah. <laughs> what a fucking freak. You could, it even puts like a, a condiment on there. What a fucking I'm like, freak. I'm fucking avocado. When you guys hey. start eating shit, just let me have Laura. this, okay? Come on. Fuck. He he did he he did he did come in it. So like there is a condiment. Um. Okay. Gross. It's so, not my cup. As you get ready. It's so good. Um. I would like to ask Davian once more to make both a survival oh. check and just roll a flat d20. In well, theory, good, we should be finding the first, like, couple things, and they say on average it's like three, it'd be like three random things, and then with our focusing we'd get to where we want to go, so that's been three three clearings in the forest, right? Dirty 20. Okay. Ooh. The, the survival. Yeah. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. And then a... a 12 oh. on the d20. So you travel on, kind of following the scent of a burning fire not too far. And in the far distance, you hear shouting and muffled steps. But before you get to look through the tree line, suddenly you hear a very loud belch coming from Elazarin's bag. Ah! Uh, what? I will open my bag. And just be like. And as you open your bag, you see on top of all your stuff, right beside a half eaten ration, this small sprite snoozing. Aww, that's cute. I will very <laughs> gently mm -hmm. just pick it up. Is it like teeny tiny? Is it like tiny or something? Yeah, it's like, like, it's like this, this big. Oh, I'll, I'll pick it up and just kind of hold out in front of me. What? What am I? Where am I? Hello. Oh. <laughs> How are you and doing there, you bud? Really gave those hags hell, huh? Good for you. <clears throat> so, you can just have the ration though, right? Like, you didn't go through anything else. Didn't eat anything else. Well, there. I think I slipped into your bag. What was it? Maybe half an hour after you left that lady's camp, which I definitely didn't know you were. I've been in your bag for a while, and I'm a little <laughs> hungry, so I ate some of your food, and I apologize. That was not oh, very nice. Oh, no. oh, no, that's fine. You didn't eat anything important in there, because there are some very harmful toxins, and I didn't want you to get hurt. No, I just eat your, ate your food, and then I fell asleep. That's fine. Um, I'm sure. I'm gonna I'll put my hand down and put him down. <clears throat> yeah. So, uh, what's your name? Who are you? My name is Pir, P-I-R, and, okay. um, well, I don't know, I just live in these woods, and I saw you and your friends, uh, trudging along, and you guys seemed interesting, so I decided to hitch a ride, and, I don't know, got a little hungry, went for a snack, and here we are. As, as, he, as he says that, because Elazar's the whole I just, like, stick my ghost head out next to Elazar's real head, and I'm like, big fan of hitchhiking. No! I understand the impulse. Okay. Hi. How many more of you are there? In there? Well, uh, that's for us to know. <laughs> Tell us the secret. I'll, I'll yeah. go back inside a Lazarus now. <clears throat> like, my ghost. Yeah, um, <laughs> so, if it's nothing to you, I shall move on now. <clears throat> oh, no, you can, you can stay hitchhiking all you like. Oh. You just have to ask. Just the polite thing to do. Yeah, okay. And you know, it's a high risk place to hitchhike in. We did just fight some hags. You might get bopped around in there. Yeah, I'll be fine. There's a lot of, you know, pockets in these bags that I can just kind of nestle in. Cushions the balls. He is a fan of pockets. Um, yeah, so, um, <clears throat> well, um, this definitely isn't awkward. What's your name? I'm, my name is Elazarin. Hmm. 
We are a group. That's Davian. That's Jax. The ghost thing you saw was Daigon. No. Uh, yeah, you're more than welcome to to um, tag along. Just to say, that the group does sometimes get a little bumpy, so I'll just make sure you're in a safe pocket and I'll open up. I'm going to be honest, like now that I'm invited along, it just doesn't sound as fun anymore, <laughs> you know? The whole the half of the fun is you guys not knowing I'm there and me learning interesting things about you. Well, what did you learn? Um, a couple of things. You're looking for a green dragon. Well, you're looking for a way into the green dragon's lair first, which is why you're going to these camps. Uh, one of which lies just beyond that tree line over there. Um, one of the things I've learned is that, um, well, that's about it, really. I fell asleep for, like, half of it. Um, well, I don't want to put the list. I've learned a lot of other things about other people, though, so I'm a fountain of knowledge. I mean, maybe trade? You ate some of our food, so you share some of knowledge? Okay. What do you want to know? Um, what's the most interesting thing you've learned about something in these woods that you think no one else will know? Mm. But you. <laughs> well, the person. There's a lot. Um. Pick one. Hmm. Eeny. 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 Yes. Okay. So basically, um, this whole thing about the woods. You know, you you'll get where you want to go as long as you keep the the thing in mind. There are ways around that, that not many people know of. Um, I, I once traveled along with um, this, this, this big half-dragon guy, a big sword he was dragging around with him, so big that it drags it over the floor instead of on his back, because it's so huge. Um, I think he's, a, he's, he's he might be the leader of one of those camps you're going to. Oh. The camps are connected. Okay. There's a hidden oh, that's very passage, a, a portal, that takes you from one camp to the next, so you can skip the whole going through the woods thing for the next two two camps you're going to. Ah. Yeah, that's pretty clever, right? Yeah, that's Where very helpful. Where is this connection? Uh, in the leader's tent. I once lived there for about two weeks before he figured out I was there, and then he tried to hit me with his big sword, but I'm very tiny and hard to hit, so I just kind of dipped. Nice. Well, that's very helpful. That's a very good trade. Mm -hmm. Can I, Thank you. in exchange, have the rest of that ration? You can oh. have mine. Yeah, that's fine. You can have the rest of that cool. ration. Exactly. I mean, pro I'll be honest. Probably not the best anyway. I mean, rations so. are very shelf stable. It's all good. You don't really, you know, it's already dried fruit and stuff. I mean, it's not true. How much of dryer can it get? <laughs> that's very true. What you can do for the rest of the ration, though, hmm? don't say you can have a little look in the camp we're about to go to and just. Maybe tell us how many people are there, and hmm. a little lay the land. And I gotta go. <laughs> yeah. And just kind of like, begins, begins floating above your hand, and just kind of... <laughs> I mean, that's See, so pretty I then like slowly just like close my hand, just like, so close. <laughs> okay, I could have had so much. One more innocent life could have been gone. <laughs> oh my god, your villain yeah, arc. And he, and he just no. flies off. He's like, nope, I'm good. It all started with the statue. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It started way before then. Um, <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah. um, no, just blood. Well, quirky little interaction with a little. That's interesting. And I will now, uh, just before we move on, I will look through my bag to make sure it's, like <laughs> everything is else. just everything is still there. Uh... Uh, you notice that there's definitely more than just one ration that has gone missing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's he's, right. he's definitely been eaten. <laughs> he's been eaten. He was. If, uh, if it's not, if it's just rations, I'm pretty sure like I have like three in there because Jack's the fucking bag of holding. Oh, if you only had three boy. rations, then all three are gone. Oh, uh, they're all gone. Yeah. Oh, nice. They're gone. That was the number nice. I had written down. <laughs> oh, let me double check. <laughs> It's it's a small number. I know that much. I don't. I know I don't have that many. Yeah, I have like the four. massive bulk of them. Oh yeah. no, I, I I have four. Oh, there you go. So you, you have, have one, one ration left. left. Oh yeah. 
Uh, and that's yeah. all you get. Cool. Uh, you do now know a little bit more about potentially skipping a lot of arbitrary travel through the woods. Yeah. Which um, is very helpful. And you also learned that oh, yeah. this, presumably this camp, uh, given the tracks that have been found earlier of this blade being dragged over the ground, yeah. uh, that that might be the like this leader of this kobold camp is some kind of large sword carrying half dragon. Oh, um, that looks. Weird. And with that knowledge, you uh, I can't. have a little look through the tree line, perhaps, Ew. to see what's next. Hell yeah, I'm having a low. Um, I'm definitely having a look. Okay. So. Uh, within Natalish. the upcoming shadowy part of the forest, you find a hidden camp nestled deep within. Where the trees are tall and ancient, their thick canopies casting a permanent twilight below. The camp is surrounded by a crude wooden wall, constructed from uneven logs and sharpened stakes. The wall is reinforced with thorny vines, adding an extra layer of natural defense. The entrance is a narrow, heavily guarded gate, with a rickety watchtower perched above it, manned by a vigilant kobold archer. Inside the camp, you see several small, primitive huts made from a mix of wood, mud, and thatch. The huts are clustered together around a central fire pit where a smoky fire is constantly burning, filling the air with the smell of cooked meat and damp wood. The ground is littered with bones, discarded tools, and makeshift traps, a clear indication of the camp's rough survivalist nature. And if you would like to find out some more, I would like you to make a perception check, please. That's a 21. 21, okay. You see kobolds scurrying around the camp, their scaly skin a dull, earthy color that blends well with the forest surroundings. They are small and wiry, with sharp claws and teeth, wearing simple ragged clothing. Some are busy tending to the fire, while others are sharpening weapons or setting traps around the perimeter. You see, dominating the camp is the leader's hut, slightly larger and, of more, and more fortified than the others, adorned with trophies of past conquests, skulls, bones, faded banners. Standing outside of this hut is a leader, a vicious-looking green half-dragon. His draconic features are striking scales that shimmer in various shades of green, a pair of curved horns atop of his head, and sharp predatory eyes that seem to glow with malevolent intelligence. He's clad in a piecemeal armor made from a mix of metal and leather, with a large, wicked-looking blade strapped to his back. His presence exudes authority and danger, commanding the respect and fear of the kobolds that serve him. You also suddenly begin to hear a loud scream. Uh -oh. Several loud screams. As a group oh. of 30 spriggans begin... Emerging oh, from the woods, yo, tossing the gang. pebbles go. at the group of kobolds that are manning the main gate, making them scream and running after them, causing another five kobolds from within the camp to follow, significantly thin in their numbers. From what you saw, there were about seven kobolds at the main gate, one in the tower, and about 20 of them in the camp. Mm -hmm. The seven at the gate, and five more from the camp, all just begin running after the, the spriggans that just dart back into the woods. So, oh, yeah. a total of 28 kobolds present in and around this camp, 12 of them have closed it off. So, almost got the numbers in half. Well, that's nice. Uh, so, all you can see now is 16 Get kobolds pranked. in the camp, one kobold in the watchtower above the, the gate, and then the and half the leader. dragon leader at the back. That's still I, a lot of enemies, I will man. <clears throat> relay that information, obviously, to the, to the group who actually probably would see it anyways. Um, and I'll also go to I'll whisper to Devin, it's like, do you think you can take out that one in the watchtower? God, yes, yes. Yeah. One well placed, well timed shot. Yeah. Um, I mean, Sam might be able to be like a spiritual weapon up there to maybe do a little bit of damage, but I, I, I'll, you know, I'll whisper the, the command word to my uh, yeah. my dog. Dragon could help uh, do her. Yeah, I can. I, I'll add an invoke smite to the arrow, so the arrow will have extra radiant damage as well. Oh, yeah. Because I have unlimited of that, I can just do it. Oh, nice. so. Good call, Jax. Is there anything that will I'm here. make me more likely to hit it? It's the real question. Uh, that I cannot. <laughs> not help. without, not without me, like giving Spending away our position. Something. Yeah. yeah, there's not much I can do. Fairy fire help. or something, but it, that I mean, I could. Away. Yes, yeah, like I could cast fairy fire, but I think that would then raise the alarm. Fucking yeah, instantly. all of a sudden glowing lights. I mean, oh, this, forest, uh, this forest is weird and fey wildy. Glowing lights appearing might not be too like big of a stretch. I want to give um, Elazard my moon blossom potion of spell recovery. Oh, yeah. oh. it's it's on D and D Beyond as a Hell as an yeah. item, so you can just add it. And basically, uh, I'll do the invoke smite right before you shoot, so that it doesn't like the light glowing doesn't 
also appear beforehand and distract. Well, is it potion of moon blossom? Uh, if you type in moon blossom, I think it's, it's, moon, blossom. it's, I think it's moon blossom. Just type in moon blossom. Spell yeah. recovery. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I got it. I mean, uh, I'm might just drink that straight away. No. <laughs> Why not? Get some spells back. Yeah. Literally, it's just to get a fifth level spell back. Oh, to get like I mean, mass cure wound or something back. Yeah. Get yeah. circle sure. power back. Yeah, get sickle power. Yeah, I'm, I'm drinking it now. Yeah, cool. Just you give it to me. I'm like, oh sweet. Oh, as sweet. you kind of oh, like uh, kind of cool. drink it, you can see as you yeah. uncork it, there's some like faint like blue vapor that kind of escapes. As you drink it, there's a very cold liquid and the best i could describe it it's like it kind of has a, like an iced tea kind of flavor to it well that sounds nice <laughs> nice yo it's sparkling iced tea let's go Bro, he's, got some, he's got some sweet tea Shit. no no <laughs> that's, that's pretty yummy i'm allergic to that yeah. right hell yeah so uh, am i gonna it's fine yeah. do we do we have a tail spy map for this one uh i Fucking close out of it, but I can give you a quick little little, little tease for 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 all of that, and you can yeah. Oh, little tease. I just have to relaunch Tales real quick. Give me a sec. Yeah, tease. No e. Giving us a little tease. Give me that little tease, yeah. You teasing me, True Segundo. So we have to. Should we have to back out, or will it automatically pull us once you open it, it if we're still in Tales Player? Like the fact that you haven't been kicked, even though I closed the game, is kind of wild. Yeah. To me, but, yeah. Uh, I mean, I can't do anything, but it's still open. It's just it's waiting on GM. Mm, right, okay. Yeah, oh my god, we're here. Uh, let me quickly... Forward. What the hell? Dude, you can stay awake for another combat, dude. Easy peasy. <laughs> I, I can stay awake for another combat, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, you sure? Will you enjoy it? <laughs> for a combat, yeah. Okay. Alright. Just not for so You should be able to... <laughs> yeah, because yeah, it's... No, I know. Summon... I'm not judging you. I'm just clarifying. Combat is like, just do numbers. Yeah. RP is like, be a big person? Yeah. Hell no. <laughs> um, so here oh, is shit. the cam. So these oh, kobolds... that, I didn't realize you were that close. Holy fuck. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I just put you there. I know, the sake of... I know but I was like, oh shit. Uh, these kobolds... Elasmus in a tree. He <gasps> am! You are! <laughs> what did no. you do? I am. Oh. Uh, these kobolds are all gone, and five kobolds from inside the camp also. Well, there's that twilight shit going on, right? So I'm just going off. There's lava? Uh, nah, it's it's a fire pit. Um, I probably have to give you guys control over your boys again. Yes, sir. <laughs> it looks like autumn leaves. Uh, In that, what's that thing at the back? Leader uh, hut. That's the the hut of the leader. Oh, okay. And see in front of the door standing powering dragon. Um is Daigon. So never draw a meteor swarm on them. Daigon. Oh. He doesn't spawn in for me. Huh? I think it's because we don't have No no, I don't know. Everybody's there for me. What'd you say? I don't see the leader. I didn't see the leader. Uh, this guy right here? He's inside the tent, bro. Wait, is he, what? No, he's. I see everyone else. I don't see the leader. The leader's inside the tent. Oh, he's not inside. He's, he's in front of it. Wait, if I put him oh. here? I... Yeah, I don't see him. No. What? Do we all need to reset real quick? Is oh. there some fog of war shit going on, or...? No. Oh, that might, it might be line of sight, maybe? Yeah, it, it might be. Wait, if I move you here, you see him? Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. yeah okay. There's yeah. a lot yeah. more of the guys, too. Yeah, cool. Uh, there's some line of sight shenanigans going on. Got oh, it. Okay, okay. That, makes, that makes a lot more sense. I was like, oh, okay. Sometimes the line of sight in Teal Spire works, and sometimes it doesn't. Yeah, it's very strange. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, so as you can see, there's one kobold in the watchtower. The rest of them are kind of all collected oh, around the fire pit, and then there is their leader back yeah. of his hut. Mm -hmm. We can see now. Uh, yeah, so what would you guys like to do? Are we doing the try and yeah. snipe the watchtower guy? <clears throat> yeah. Yep, yeah. I have... I got a bad feeling about this. But I'm gonna take a shot at the uh, watchtower kobold. 
and I will add an invoke smite to it if it hits. Well, I mean, not if it hits, I'm adding it regardless. But... Oh, 18, nat natural 18. That hits. So Yay. A 20 something. Uh, four. Probably should have hunted smite him first, but it doesn't matter. Uh, one D. What's the oh. smite damage? Uh, I'm checking my wisdom uh, modifier because no, things. yeah. Um, I rolled ten points of radiant. Okay, damage ten for points this of radiant. Jeez. Uh oh. I rolled a six and a four on my d8s. Four points of piercing. And six points of acid damage. So twenty points of damage total. You fire your arrow, and as it like kind of shoots through this like perpetual twilight. Um, uh, environment. You can see the arrow kind of giving off this like bluish hue as it just plants itself in the forehead of this cobalt, and the cobalt just slumps over. Woohoo! Ah. So now have the gates are wide open. Mouth wide open. What would you guys it's like so to do? Funny. I think I see the watchtower uh, guy go down and just like it's an instant run to like just oh my yeah. god yeah, where, where are the, you're above the trees right now just drop yourself <laughs> go. can it's I make it towards the... since I have a climbing speed mm -hmm. can I stealthily scale the wall uh, into as the I watchtower? described it doesn't show up in tailspire because I didn't have that okay. I don't have the assets but vines I, and there's spikes, a bunch right? of thorny vines and spikes kind of adorning the outside of the tree Wait, hold. But, Don't we have but, like a ladder but, somewhere? Can no. I but, can I give it a shot? I mean, I can. Do you have a cloak? I've, I still have some windows. The patches. <laughs> I don't yeah, know the, the, the patches. Yeah, it's I, wait, but it's perpetual twilight. You can fly. I can fly over it, yeah. I can also fly. Well, I'm in I'm also in hitchhiking. Yeah, I, can, I mean I can fly over it. Yeah. But I think my sparkly flying will give us a lift. Because it's not like a oh, I do sort of glow. <laughs> It's can like, we not why? fly? Can we not allow us to use the watchtower for cover? Like, if I move my token and show you where I'm. Oh, I, I suppose. Like, we, we fly like... around in this corner mm -hmm. using the tower to cover us, and we get in the camp, like, in here. Yeah. Sure. I want to try oh. something kind of. Oh, no. Oh, okay. mm. There we go. I'm in it. I'm in the camp. Hang on. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> I'm in. I'm in. I say I got some stuff I can throw out there if we need, but I mean I can also if like I'm probably get through some shell. Because imagine you do a blanket fairy fire, just get all the kobolds. That's so sort advantage. of like yeah. the plan. I That's yeah so I yeah. well I've just got a little idea. I, I mean... can hit the whole camp with something. I can. I could, le I could levitate myself over the wall. <laughs> Hold on. Can I? I just want to check something really quick. Uh, Thirty feet, six tiles, right? Mm -hmm. mm, kind of stinks. Okay. Um. I wish I could fly. <laughs> oh, the fuck. Oh, I just betrayed him. Hmm. I mean, also, this whole camp is very flammable. Everything's wood. I mean, I mean everything, though. I don't need you know, to be in that it to attack them, I guess. Yeah, I, I guess yeah you can just eat either. a fireball and burn all these kobolds. I cannot eat a fireball. Aw, oh, darn. <laughs> Not without <laughs> exhausting my charges on my staff of power and then potentially yeah. losing forever. Yeah. Is the 20 foot square by any chance? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, cool. Oh, 30 foot. Oh, it's 30 foot. Well, then it would be 6 by 6, wouldn't it? This is by six. No, it's five by five. No, yeah, it's five by five. Well, it's yeah, twenty-three cause... point something tiles. That's six. Uh, that's six. No, there's no, three no, big squares. It's six. It's a little off, but yeah. 
It's close enough. It's six. Yeah. Wouldn't it? Oh, because oh, it takes. Because the takes tile off. total is weird, but okay. Yeah. No, my bad. I, Duke, um, I was the exact same thing. Yeah. Like, I was like, do, that's do not you right. want me to do my thing or? Uh, does your ting? My ting potentially incapacitates all of them. Does oh, I say, does it get better if I fairy fire or not? No, no, because okay, it'll be a save. Yeah. Then in fact, the them. less damage done after I do this on separate individual targets that we fight, the better. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Fucking go for it. Because I'm only gonna. I'm just gonna kind of eat my head real quick. Um, your wiser square is so bad. What? It's not. Well, <laughs> anyways, we we would want it like one more forward to actually hit the boss. But anyway, okay. I don't know how to get rid of it. Um, help. and I'm gonna cast hypnotic pattern. Okay. As I throw little buttons in the air. Interesting. Right? Isn't that buttons? <laughs> Oh, it's a crystal vial filled with phosphorescent material, apparently. What's the effect here? Um, I throw a twisting pattern of colors that weaves through the air inside a 30-foot cube within Hit range. The, mm -hmm. uh, the pattern appears for a moment and vanishes. Each creature in the area who sees a pattern must make a wisdom saving throw. Yeah, but what's the effect? Is it a charm effect? Uh, fuck, it's charm. <clears throat> Ooh, I forgot that it's charm. Well, too late now. Okay. Mm. What's a DC? 20. 20, okay. Um, um, because, okay, so the interesting thing is creature stat block line. This is a horde of kobolds. Like, this is not just... Oh, kobolds. it's like, like a swarm. It's one uh, thing. It's a swarm yeah. thing. It's one... Got it, got okay. it, got it, got it. So because the horde failed its save... Oh, uh -oh. All the kobolds are now strong. <laughs> uh, -oh. <laughs> uh, the leader did make the save. Well, that's, that's... fine. We can focus but him. You not... I'm charmed... assuming he probably has advantage because of charm. Uh, you successfully charmed but... the entire like horde of kobolds. And that works. I mean, I'll take that. Does the leader know? I mean, he sees it and probably sees me because I have to, like right. You okay. Know, around, so. so as you do that, he just kind of like takes the blade from his back and it is this uh has a name and everything um, wait the blade has a name it does. Mm. oh shit mm. so we're big taking that when we kill him big big but large huge the blade close <laughs> very close uh force <laughs> in the fires of mcdonald's the giant craft ambush it. Ooh. oh like oh, yeah, oh. Really uh, that that's um, give me a sec. Not scary at all. Let me find it real quick. There is. He, it's not a blade. Sorry, it's an axe. I sound corrected. It's an axe. How dare uh, you? Uh, that's axe. even. That's kind of scary, almost. I think. Um, he takes the axe from his back, and he just says, "In does anyone here speak Draconic?" Yeah, because of the Someone hat. Someone does. You hear him oh, yeah. shout in Draconic. Trespasses. Come here to die. And then he yeah. shouts, Grow in Draconic. And you see the oh. axe go from a normal great axe oh, to a no. great axe three times its size. I oh. if I could do that. And it, he just, he's still just holding on to it as if nothing changed, as he's carrying this 15 foot long great axe. axe. No, I have That's something that does that too. Ship. And he just oh, kind oh, of like oh. braces himself. And I like everyone's roll initiative. Oh boy, can I roll better than a natural one this time? Like, technically, how can I, how can I not? Oh, Ooh, I, I actually that. just nat one, so. Oh, <laughs> I go. almost did. I almost did, and then it moved. Luckily, because Why I... did you guys have to curse me too? Oh, boys. Uh oh, this is gonna be bad. I hate this, dude. All right, why well, uh, got... initiative of 20 or more? I got 23. Nice. Okay. I'm yes. negative, so don't mind <laughs> 15, 15 to 20? I'll move Jax all the way to the back. <laughs> okay. Uh, interesting. I'll, I'll go in like three turn orders, you know? Uh, Dabby and Diagon, what do you guys roll? 
Ten. Ten. And that one. That one? Oh my god. Was yours also in that one, Soko? Yes, so I'm at negative one. Okay, so we'll say that Davian <laughs> goes first between you two. So Elijah, what would you like to do? Yeah. Oh boy. Uh, oh god. Uh, I will. What the fuck Still is this? Gobbled. Yeah. Oh, there's so much. So much it could do. Focus, big guy, leave. Yeah, that's sort of the plan. Uh, but. Yeah, fuck it. I'm just gonna. Let me just double check what my. If I believe my flight speed just becomes my walk speed. Oh, I should give you. Yeah, because my walking speed. So. Like, uh. Uh. Oh my fucking god, I hate this. <laughs> That's like. It hates you too. <laughs> it's 15, 20, 25, 30. Wow, I can get to here. Amazing. But keep in mind that you going up is also moving. I know. That's okay, okay. that's 15 feet and 15 feet. All oh, right, okay, okay. Just make it sure. Just make it sure. Yeah, 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 don't worry. That's why I was like. Imagine if while I was hitchhiking with them, I could somehow give them my feline agility and uh, like make them I'd like be... like. Double, double their movement speed. So that would That'd be. be so cool. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be cool. And I will. Definitely not broken. Uh, do I just. Yeah. And I. Will then cast Aura of Purity. Oh. So 30 feet around me. Um. Yeah, and nothing, anything in the aura cannot be diseased, has resistance to poison damage, has advantage on saving throw against blinded, charms, deafened, frightened, paralyzed, poisoned, and stunned. Jesus. Ooh. Pretty much any status. Any status yeah, condition, and you guys all condition. have an advantage on, and you also all have resistance to poison. How close do you have to be to you? 30. It's the same as the dome. Okay. It's, it's exact same as the dome. It travels with me, it's the dome. Oh, cool. Uh, and... That will be my turn. Okay. It is now the half dragon turn. And he is going to. You're 15 feet up? Yeah. Oh, he can hit you because his weapon's huge. He's 15 foot reach with his. Uh, yeah. Can... He's going to just. Yeah, if I need to do a swing at closer. you three <laughs> yeah. times with it. Bopping you out yeah, of the sky. Um, like, fucking Jesus Christ. <laughs> First attack is a 21 to hit. Misses. Second attack is a 23 to hit. Hits. I will Divine Barrier and Third. add 4 to your AC. Misses. Third attack is a 28 to hit. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, misses. Silver so Ball? One out of misses. three. One out of three, yeah. not bad. Okay. Mm. Oh my fucking god. It's huge. Also, I'm, I'm now huge. up in the air next to you because I got pushed out oh. when I used Divine Barrier. To say anyone in this dome, I'll, I'll but I feel like it's fucking yeah. gonna be no one because I'm too high up to give anyone this. Uh, well, it's not centered on you right now. Oh, they fucking center on me. Go on. Uh, height is weird. Height oh, is see. weird, yeah. Uh, okay, boom. So, how big? Six tiles? Yes, please. Danke. Uh, Laura, I gave you flight. Yes. So where are you? are like right next to Quavo I'll be ne I'll be pushed out right next to him. So I'll just be like the square behind him. Yeah, and up in the air. Because I can fly so I can stay hovering up yeah, there. Yeah. So I wouldn't fall to the ground. Okay. Um, Elasvin. Mm -hmm. You take. At least you only hit once. <laughs> mm. Well, twice, right? No, because I divide barriered one, and then he missed the first one. Oh, right. Right. 31 points of magical slashing damage. Jesus. Imagine oh. if he'd hit all three of those! Yeah, Fucking no, right. Hell. Well, I need to make a concentration check. Is that a high roll? Um, that is his turn, I think. What was the, what was the total 15. touch? It was DC 31, 15? so DC 15. Oh, oh thank fuck, uh, the day 20. All right. Hell yeah. There you go. Nice. Uh, it is now the Kobold Horde turn. Um... They don't get a turn, they're incapacitated, and their speed is zero. All right. Hey! hey. <laughs> okay. Uh, I cannot hitchhike with a Lazarin now. Um, 
Uh, I will... I'm gonna... Since I've been pushed out, I'll go back into my body, uh, which is, we'll say it's outside with Brooks, so I'll go back here. How do I make myself go to the ground again? Just hold, Actually, control. Wait. hold control while... Well, also, check, probably check the move as well, because you're gonna be yeah, 15 yeah, 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 feet yeah. up. And... Yeah, my fly speed is 30 feet, so... 5, 10, 15... 20, 25. So I'm not back in my body yet, because I mm -hmm. used the movement to fly out here, but I'm okay. still, I'll be in the air. Um, and I will uh, do an invoke smite, I guess, on... Actually, no, wait, I'll use my feline agility now to d double my movement speed so I can get back down to the ground and get in my body okay. as the bonus action. And then action. I don't know if he's gonna do it, but I don't know what either of them are gonna do. Um, I don't know if Davian will want to use his bow or use something else. I don't know what Jax is gonna do. I will make Jax's hammer glow with invoke smite because I don't know what he's gonna do yet, but just in case. <laughs> that definitely changes what I was gonna do. So. Well, I don't, don't feel like you have to. Just no, 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 no. Like, I, I, I mean, like I. I'm, deba I'm debating on a few things. Actually, wait, no, I, I take it back anyway, because I seeing it, the reach that guy has, the giant weapon, and what it just did to a Lazarin, I'll, instead, even, he may not use it, but I will make Davian's, like, the, the arrows in his quiver glow with the energy instead, okay. so that, if he, if he attacks that way, he'll get the extra. That's very good, very good. All right, Davian. One of your Hi. arrows has been <laughs> invoked with Schmite yet again. Let's do it. Yet again... Yet again. And so yes, I will. Drag, this this half dragon is now carrying a fifteen foot long great axe. Just... <laughs> he has big reach. <laughs> yeah, I, I'll hunt his mark him off for it. Okay. Um, yeah, uh, and then I will shoot him twice with my. Asimo longbow that is still d dripping with acid. Mm -hmm. Shot number one is a natty 19 plus 9, 28. Mm -hmm. Or, and oh, yeah. this, oh, you roll the smite, right, Laura? I roll the smite. It's not yeah. great, but it's an extra seven points of radiant damage mm -hmm. on top of whatever else you're doing. Every bit helps. Mm -hmm. uh, and I'm rolling 1d8 and a d6. Bow, so four, seven, ten points of magical piercing damage, and then eight points of acid damage. Okay. Uh, and I will fire again. How much was the smite again? It was seven radiant damage seven. for the smite. Yeah. That's a four, fourteen to hit with the check one. Fourteen misses. Mm. Uh, and that is my turn. Jax? Yeah. Um, I will run up to... Oh, I'll get right on your Lazarin. What? And then I am going to cast Mirror Image. It's not concentration, which is crazy to me. Nice. Sick. Yeah. Did not realize that. That's cool. Um, it's three duplicates. So just fucking... three duplicates pop out. And that's my turn. Yeah. Oakley, oh. Oakley. Um, 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 um. um. Wait, sorry, you already fucking skipped your turn. My bad. You're the only yep. one that like does it yourself, so like I'm so used to hitting. Oh. Uh, uh, Elijah. Even though we could do that lol. Yeah, you can. Okay. Uh, am I able to be flanking with Jax? I mean, I technically haven't attacked him yet. But... Oh, okay. Plus, is it flanking if you're flying because you're not? No, 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 no. I'll be, I'll be dropping down. I'm gonna oh, be okay. going like five, ten, fifteen to like behind him. Gotcha. Uh, yeah, you would be flanking with Jackson. And then, oh my fucking god! Oh, come on! Go and drag down, bud. You got it. So, 
I Dungeon. believe. It could be like the weird edges on the roofs too. It was. It was like. Oh, was it? Right, right, right. Yeah, and it was like not happy. It wasn't like falling out. Usually does. Not happy. It was not happy. I need to move. Uh, yeah. With you, huh? uh, yeah. Uh, and then it's, that needs to like drop in height as well, right? Yeah. Don't go. Uh, yeah, and then I'll just take out the Dragonbone Cleaver. And this thing is definitely Dragonkin. Dragon Paul. Wait, really? He's a half dragon warrior and he's dragon king? Yeah, that's Wait, great. Yeah. yeah, so this half dragon, uh, you faced half dragons before when you were chasing the other. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. You're facing uh, the first of the dragons you're going to Death kill. More. Uh, Death Jaw. Uh, and these are just very brutish, feral looking dragonborn, essentially, whereas they definitely have like actual dragon heads. Very broad, like big, sharp claws, large tail. It's it's basically as close as you're gonna get to like a wingless dragon, essentially. Yeah, so does a thirty hit? Yeah, I guess. We're gonna do an extra two d six slashing damage, uh, and it needs to make a Constitution saving throw. Save, save. Hmm. Uh. Well, less than eight. Uh, is incapacitated. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Uh, it takes, uh, 14 points of damage. Damage? All right. Mm, that's uh, incapacitated means... I can't out. take actions or reactions. Yeah. And it's until, it is unfortunately only until the end of their next turn. So... So it can just move, I guess? Correct. No, I think can move an incapacitated king. It's, yeah, because it's just, it's no just interaction or, to reactions. No actions or reactions. It's, it's why uh, hypnotic patterns st uh, stipulates that they can't move at all either. Why their oh, speed drops to zero. That's why, that's why I was making sure too, because I was like, oh, okay. That makes oh, because a lot of things are usually stunned and incapacitated. Yeah, exactly. yeah, usually incapacitated yeah. To come, to often comes paired with yeah. some other With, shit. like, unconscious and all that yeah. shit, right? Yeah. Uh, okay, is that your turn? Yeah, it's my turn. Cool. Um, as this half dragon just kind of stands there, not able to really do anything, you suddenly, even though you're in this like perpetual twilight, see shadows kind of coming overhead and bursting oh. through the canopy of the a gargantuan green dragon. And it just kind of hovers there, and you just oh, hear no, 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 no. its voice booming through the woods. Oh, dear. So I see. It wasn't enough for you to take down the biggest idiot of our little group. It appears that I'm next. Well, I wish you all the best. We're going to need it. And he opens his mouth. Oh, I hate it. And you bastards. Uh, and send it on you two, because you're the only ones in the camp. It opens his mouth and everyone in this camp is getting it. Like, he doesn't give a fuck. Um, he doesn't give a shit. I need you all, I believe it's constitution. Let me double check. Please be constitution. It's like my second best saving throw. It's like my boss. It's, it's either Constitution or Dex. So you're either like good or fucked. Oh, I hate uh, it here. Uh, constitution. Saving throw. Fuck. Hey. So you know what I said about Constitution saving throws being my best? Oh, oh mm -hmm. no. Yeah, I rolled a net once. That doesn't fucking matter. Oh, no, it doesn't. How many have I rolled this today? I swear Yikes. it's a lot. Yo, dirty twenty. Fuck you. It's not enough. <laughs> I mean, Brixhoff is an ancient green. I know, I know. <laughs> but yeah, like, but like 20? Um, you know what's so sad? And I've already used my divine barrier. And that's fine. It's fine. Um, protected you. It won't do that much damage. Wait, isn't Dragon getting hit too? No. No, I'm out. Oh, I'm out. out. Oh, that's right. Oh, that's right. You. I th I so basically, the breath camp, covers so the good. entirety of the camp. Anything outside of the camp? And I'm yes. outside now. Cool, cool, cool. cool. How, how, long was our, how long was our short rest? An hour. An hour. Okay. Um. So, that said. Mm -hmm. Can I resist it? 
At least resist oh, no. it if it's poison. I know. This he's, motherfucker says acid. These <laughs> kobolds. No, it is poison, man. Oh. He's gonna kill all the kobolds all for us. All the kobolds us. are dead. Yay! Yeah. Right. Not like this, they were able to do anything anyways. This guy not so much, but you each take 22 d6. Huh? <laughs> Sorry, Yo, just, uh, run that back. No, no, no sorry, on, but on, Dad, I think I misheard you <laughs> because I think you said twenty-two, but I think did did you just mean two? D6? No, I mean twenty-two. <laughs> Are you sure D6? you're reading the paper right? Yeah, oh, is is it a misprint? Oh, poison come breath. Up, like, the dragon exhales poison gas. I think gas. you're the wrong edition. Each creature in the area <laughs> must make a DC twenty-two Constitution saving throw. Oh. Yes, yeah, that's twenty-two. Taking twenty-two D six poison damage on a failed save. Oh, oh, uh, I, I, okay. I think I see the problem, Dutch. Right. I think you have the. You have the fifth edition. Yeah. We're playing one D and D. Oh, are we? And in one D and D, it's just two D six. We're playing Goo Goo Gaga baby uh, mode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right. Yeah, I've playing got Baldur's the, Gate Explorers I've got, uh, mode. I, I've got it on story mode, so like mm. the combat's like not as bad. So. That is unfortunate that I did not get Ugh. that memo before I set this up. Hey guys. Ugh, crazy that it was so weird. Yo, Dutch throws into honor mode, guys. Kind of cringe. You know? Yeah. I don't have enough D sixes for this. Cringe. <laughs> Shut <laughs> the fuck up. <laughs> Imagine having enough D6 is loser. Uh, yo, uh, okay, hold on. Just roll 10, 10. <laughs> just roll oh, 11 twice. You want me to just delete my character sheet right now? Yeah, hang on. Let me just, let me spill up my new one. Actually, I, I, to be honest, it would be hard to kill me in one shot regardless, but. Oh, it is very doable for me. It's not for me. I, I literally have 110 max HP, so. You'd have to roll Wait, like pretty much the max the, to actually knock me unconscious. The, what's the max? What, 22 times by 6? If you rolled 6 on everything, 132. Wow. That's, that's what I'm saying. Like, he could only put me unconscious. He couldn't actually outright kill me. He would have to have rolled max, and I could, I could die outright. Well, no, no, you just go unconscious what? because you, you, you take your resistance, so. Oh, you're fucking right. Yeah. And plus you have pass the save now, too, so. Huh? Because you passed the save. Oh, wait, you didn't, didn't pass, pass the save. Wait, that's right. Save. Fuck. So... And then also See, to pass that save, I have to roll 13 or above. That's wild. I mean, to pass that save, I have to roll a natural 20. Yeah, I need plus two. Dutch you so both take math. 75 points go. of poison damage. Oh, that's all? Yo, I rolled 69. That's yeah. baby damage. What's that? Bro. Wait, is that halved already? No. Oh. Okay. So 30. 37? Seven. Yeah. Okay. That's not okay. bad. Okay. Oh, I'm uh, fine. I'm not even bloody. We're chilling. I'm, I'm pretty shit. bliss. I'm pretty bliss. Well, let me just yeah. quickly for the, you know, let me give out a little, a little small little tidbit. Give me I swear to fucking god, if this guy just puts down the Wait, fucking. Why do you have a tidbit? I don't need a tidbit. <laughs> so I forgot ten of the D two, the D sixes. Oh my bad. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh no, oh, sorry. I, I forgot about the second dragon that shows up. <laughs> no, I forgot that when I, I can reroll ones and twos. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There's a little tidbit. Yeah, there, there he is. Why is is he this there? just a little drive by? Yeah, I they drive by. That is so dope that you actually got like a dragon minion here, though. This is the only dragon type that comes with Tailspire. Oh, that's crazy. At least it's green. green. Nice. I'm sure you can change the color, actually. No, I can't. Eh. No, I cannot. But you can't? No. Oh, that's kind of dumb. It's dumb. That's why I had to make like a custom one for. And they should just oh, let you change okay. colors. Well, no. All right. Ooh, it's a big boy. So, a little small. With that, once uh, Bricksoft uses his uh, poison breath, uh, and all the kobolds just wither and die, wither away and die. Uh, you can see the decay even oh. affecting the. It's just boy uh, um, The t like small tents around, and even though he's incapacitated, you just see this half dragon look up. And fear behind this guy's eye. So I rolled my concentration check. Okay. Oh no. I don't. I don't have it anymore. Because it turns out it's doesn't matter. DC eighteen. Yeah, cool. 17. It doesn't matter when you roll a natural one. <laughs> it should not matter. It doesn't matter what uh, the DC is. With that said, Dagen, no. it is now your turn. Ooh, oh no. Okay. Okay. that one. So Give me so that well. fucking smite. Oh my God. Give me that is, fucking Rickshop smite. has not moved on. He is still just hovering. He Why? Is, uh, Go away. I don't like that. Okay. Um, I will um, action invoke smite for Davian. And then bonus action. I'm going to leave 
I'm gonna leave the body behind. Oops, hold on, I was here. Okay. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Fuck. I used feline agility last turn, so I can't use it now. Are we gonna... But I'm not gonna leave the body behind. I will do that movement, but in my body, in the camp. And I will still do the invoke smite for Davian. And I just won't do anything for my bonus action this turn. Oh, oh, no, there's no friend. That's dumb. Okay, yeah, that's my turn. <laughs> right. bum, bum, bum. I'm about to spend the next three episodes charging my Kamehameha wave. Um, mm -hmm. I am going to use uh, my bonus action to cast Branding Smite. Okay, oh, yeah. <laughs> we're double, we're double smiting. <laughs> um, yeah. And I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna shoot this fucking biznatch. Which one, the half dragon? No, the trot. He's hitting the big boy. He's hitting the big boy. <laughs> He's hitting the big question. dragon, baby. Oh. Okay. I have a question. And... Does his crit apply to my damage as well? Like, yeah. is it max yes. for my? Oh, no, nice. let's go. Okay. That's fat. Fatty, fatty, shatty. Also, now I have to imbue elemental power. Yeah, yeah, I mean, uh, of course, hit it all. Yeah. This is an option. This is the time to hit it with everything. So, Yo, where's those four levels of Paladin, too? Let me... Okay. I need right, to, like, right, cool. write down all of the... <laughs> I mean, it doesn't work on right ...things now. that I'm doing here. Hold on. So... Yeah, I know. So sad, actually. So... Makes sense. It, the... From... Okay. Now with the Eight. Numbers. With, like, the holy... Plus the holy six... Like, is the God. bow? Still lame though. We just, we just make a magical item that's like plus. Pinch up it's a bow. Nice. Yeah. Twelve. Mm. Acid. Plus. Laura. Twelve radiant. Oh. Plus eight fire. Yeah, and now, and bad. now I roll. So, no, oh no, no, no. How, much eight, eight, how much is that without the roll? Okay, eight, it's, hold on, 8 plus 6 plus 3 is the bow. So, 14, 17, 29, 41, 49, before I've rolled. Huh? I mean, max damage plus rolling all plus, the dice as well. Yeah. yeah, but like, I don't and think when, I have a single way to ever do that much. When you're done, I'll tell you what my additional damage is. Yeah, so I don't okay. So, so, 49... Before I roll, so now. You have a pen and paper. You write in the shit down. <laughs> I've written. Yeah, I wrote down. Yeah, okay, yeah. so, so then, I just rolled max damage on the D8. Nice. So that's eight, and then the hunter's mark is of course, a D6, mark as well. oh, and that's a five. And then the acid is two D6. Uh, that's a four and a one. And the radiant is 2d6. And then I'll tell you my radiant to add to that because it's the same type. And that's a 6 and a 2. Plus 25 radiant damage for me. 25. <laughs> God. Plus, and then the fire <laughs> is d It's going to be like... Oh, but it's only a 1. Oh. So, wait, what did I say before? Wait. Uh, oh, no. I, oh, no, he it, lost it. Was it 49? Yeah. So you written that that down. Forty nine yeah. before. I should have written rolls. that down. Yeah, forty nine. So rolls. so this is forty nine. Then and then so forty nine. So, so fifty seven, sixty two, sixty seven, seventy five, one hundred and one hundred and one damage, damage total. Is that with is that with mine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's the yeah, twenty. Cool. Yeah. So one hundred and one maybe. So he's just hovering and just takes the impact of this. It's, it's all coming from the arrow, right? Yeah, it's one yeah. arrow. Yeah. It's one yeah. arrow has just gone. And you can see it just like peer back and kind of but like it's blowing with all sorts range. of shit. Yeah. It just looks down at you. Davian down becomes at target Lazarin number one. Dax. Blow me to raise the stakes. Oh, Ooh. no. He's going to use a legendary action. And he's going Ooh. to swoop down. Fight the Lazarin. Ooh. Not even Daphne No, don't bite a Lazarin. Don't bite a Lazarin, <laughs> but I shot. I did the shooting. 
At least hit me. Keep in mind, these guys are in tow with nightwebs. Yeah, they're, uh, they know uh, things. Uh, Natural twins. They know things. <laughs> okay, Dutch. no, that's silvery barbs. Right. That is silvery barbs. Okay. Silvery barbs. Yes, okay. yes, yes. I do have a Blaster, question. Getting one. By the way. Luna, is this is this one attack or is it multiple attacks coming my oh, way? Yeah. Okay, that's fine. I'm no longer as worried as I was. I'm okay. definitely no going on conscious by the way. That's yeah. a lot less damage. That damage has got a lot less crazy. Uh, which is a plus 15 to hit, so... Yeah, yeah 30 plus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, uh, I've got that magical ring that means 30 plus doesn't hit. Rick soft? More like dick soft. You know what I'm saying, dog? Hey, oh, my dick is soft. <laughs> well played. <laughs> Don't say that. I know we at, we just dealt 101 damage. Take 35 points of piercing damage. I am unconscious. Unconscious. But is there, is there more? Or is that it? And you are... Uh, well, you also take... 7 points of poison this damage. Is... Yes, but it's all in one. It's all in one. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, no, I, I'm unconscious. And... You are considered grappled. As you... <gasps> oh my Ooh. god! No, I'm he going! He can you! You're you can just... And you're dead. He's not even... No, it's not about instant... I'm He's fucking gonna, going. He's gonna run off with He's gonna go off with me. He's gonna take me In his mouth and kill me later. He's taking my body. Oh my god, he's killing me and taking me away. Oh. I can fix this, I can fix this, I can fix this. Can you? Uh, oh, this is so nutty, so I, I love it. it. Mm. There is... Oh, I, love I, have, I have another oh, attack. I never stood up during a fucking combat I haven't done this like before, but this... Come on, Dutch! Do it to me, come on! <laughs> I can fix, I can fix this, me. guys. Oh, hold on, hold on. okay. So, 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 Brixoth currently has a Lazarin in his mouth. Yes, yes. yes. Well, just hovering about 25 feet above the ground. Well, I'm oh, gonna okay. shoot him again. Lazarin. I, I'm... I'm literally and then the Lazarin dies to the fall damage when he drops it. <laughs> okay. Yeah. He's gonna Slack drop jaw. you and you're just gonna die. 20, okay. 20, 27 to hit. I, I don't um, think... I don't think Devian has that, that is... much of a stank hit again. And I have no more heals left. Yeah. My, all my sympathetic mendings are gone. It's fine. Uh, Guys, this is fine. Uh, this is not fine. Uh, this, uh, this is gonna be really, really embarrassing in comparison. We are fine. We are fine. It's not great. <laughs> it's not great. Six, I that way. <laughs> 16 points of damage. Damage, okay. Guys, it's crazy. We could have failed earlier. Yeah. Who, who's going to bring out the life weaver yes. to life grip mm -hmm. the out of Okay, his... we're fine. We're fine. Okay. He automatically okay. fails any saving throw I use on him, yes? Yeah. Uh, <gasps> Lazarin. <gasps> okay, yeah. Wait, wait. Is that me? I'm casting Vortex Warp. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. How long does it take? One action. No, oh, I have a thing I can do. Uh, what, 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 oh. what does it do? What um, does it... <clears throat> I, I, I basically can choose someone in range. What type of saving throw do I have to make, by the way? way? What? The constitution, but you're not going to make a 20. Uh, it, it's not automatic. I do just have to roll. It's only f it fails. Really? Wait, but you're it's, unconscious, though. It's strength and dex. Can't I you failed. choose to fail? I don't know if I can when I'm unconscious. I, I have no concept of what's happening to me. To fail it. Right, fucking roll, bitch. Uh, wait. It's looking at him. How can. Hold on. If he's unconscious, how can he resist he it to any degree that he would say? Constitution as a human being. Right? Does it mean oh, it's fighting, yeah, I guess? Yeah. I don't know. I don't yeah. Know. I mean, it doesn't matter. It's an eight, but you know. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it'd be a future, so for, a few, for future reference. <laughs> yeah. Literally like had an, to roll active, an active save would auto fail, like dex yeah. or strength or something, yeah. but you had just your body's natural okay. resistance to something. Yeah. And I'm going to teleport him right behind Davian. Oh, Dagen, sorry. Not, not, or, yeah, yeah, David, David, David. Do I take you damage? Outside you, outside the you do not. The you don't fall. He's, he's gently teleporting you to the ground. Just... Yeah. No, but I didn't have Vortex Pulp as like a, you know, like Thunder you Step Oil thing. No, you, you don't fall. Oh, hell I yeah. put you wherever I want you. Hell yeah. That's cool. <laughs> right. As Don't long as the surface can support you. No, fair. Uh, guys, this is really matter because it's my turn next. I'm gonna roll my save, and then Brixel's just gonna fucking pick me the fuck back up and fly me away. But you know, I mean, um, you know. So you do that. He's gonna use legendary action and down at you, Jax. Uh huh. Oh, not legendary. Action. He can hit me all he wants. I'm good fuck. It's down at you. You bore me. I need you to make a. Oh no. Watch it be Dex. Watch it's it wisdom. <laughs> it's wisdom. It's gonna be like some like kind of like fucking lies. Yeah, charisma. charisma. That's fine. Wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's fine. Wait. 
Well, I'm trying to think of like what it could be. It could be like banishment or something. It could be charisma. Yeah. Seventeen. With his tiny little dragon paw, you bore me. Oh no. He vanished. You. Uh, bing, bang, bang, bing, bang. Jesus, Technically, Jax as a species token of nothing, but this yep. is very much Jax's thing, mm -hmm. a person. Yeah. Or you are just sent to uh, a, a harmless. Yeah, just a it's a random like that. A yeah. random harmless thing. Or... Sick. Oh dear. Vacation. Uh, <laughs> There's one roll of this dice that can save me. A nat twenty. <laughs> I'll just DM you the... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's on a natural 20. Uh, or he's, a very, he's just playing it very good. Very Isn't that Brixoth's turn? Uh, Jax is gone. Uh, Lazar has no poker face. No, no, no. It's good thing I didn't teleport Lazar underneath uh, me. <laughs> Brixoth. Fuck it, So where did you put him down? Right behind Davian. Behind me. Behind Davian. Oh, Sorry, right, I, couldn't, I couldn't move no, him, yeah, so right, just... that's my bad. So, like, behind Davian... Yeah, it's like, yeah. <laughs> the way he fell over. <laughs> the fact that he's still over. floating, too. Oh, he's gonna get him. And he's just oh, gonna grab you. Fuck yeah, shock. Him. Is he gonna bite on me as well? Just the fucking really head. No, Stop he's just going to pick you up with grab. his mouth. Yeah. Yeah. Um, which would be like a grapple check, but you auto feel those. Yeah. So yeah. He lifts oh, you up. Oh, no. And the rest of his movement. He's fucking good! He's darting that way. Where the fuck did he just go? He just went underneath <laughs> the ground. Rixoff? He's I killed him. I <laughs> killed him! Rixoff? Oh, there you are. Woo! Hey, buddy. Hello? He just got, like, it's the cuts he's just playing. <laughs> the I just, I just pulled the tail spider equivalent just... of falling underneath the map. Falling under. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay. He, just, he just hit this, like, all this, like, Collision sounds. He's just like fucking under the map and just like Dark, Soul, Dark Souls um, boss enemy has fallen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bear with me, caller. There we go. Hey guys. Fuck. He, he's like, where was I? <laughs> and he and he just shouts, oh, kind of back at you. You hear this voice booming in the back of your heads. Nowhere to find. You. Scripted. <laughs> Um, this was definitely as inscripted in the point of like that this was gonna a be response. Tempted. This fucker better be missing like a hundred health. He is. When we <laughs> you hit yeah. when we come to clash with him. Um <laughs> is now the so half dragon's old. turn. Oh, half oh half my god, it's still bad. Oh, god. This is all like... Bell and Ethan's fault, bro. And the half it dragon is, is just them. going to wail on Jax right in front of him. No, Jack, I'm oh, gone, bitch. Oh, yeah, you're gone. I'm True. gone. Fuck. Hold on, let me hide you. I'm dead for all intents and purposes at this point. Now this one, I'll have to say, like this one looks incredibly rough as well. Um, let me just wail on Dagon then in that case, because Dagon's in the Robo body. Right. right? Yes, I am. I'm in. Body. Um, 25, 27, 21 to hit. Uh, Shh. yeah, I'll hit even with the infusion from Jax. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh wait, um. No, yes, yes, I'll hit. I will use my reaction to obfuscate whatever one does the most damage. So, whatever one does the most damage, I'm gonna half it. One deals 26 points of slashing damage, magical. Okay. Well, okay, I'm gonna write these down, then I'll do the math after. One deals 26 points of slashing damage. Okay. What's your max HP? In the body, 70, and I have 17 temporary one, hit points, 24, and then my HP after that. 26, oh, okay. 20, okay, so I will have one of the 26, I'll obfuscate one of them. I just want to check something, because if my my resistance to piercing whenever, I think magical slashing doesn't count, but I'm just double checking, because I have resistance to, for sure, as a, for sure, the regular ones. Um, could me. Uh, resistance to magical people. Ever. We're 
No, just non-magical. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna turn one of the 26s into 13 points of damage. So 13 plus 26 plus 24 is 2, 4, is 63. So my I'm still in the body. We're fine. Yeah, but the problem is, is if that body breaks, we can't repair it here either. I know, I know. I know, I'm just like, in my head, I'm just lost, dude. We're so Okay. Fun. Okay. I am down to 24 hit points in my body. Okay. Oh, yikes. I mean, Big Davian yikes. could potentially break concentration. Bring I was so excited because I was like, wait, I'm going to do my thing. The worm claw rune thing. So he can't take a Lazarus. I realized the thing I was thinking of takes eight hours. Yeah. Yeah. And I was like, yeah. fuck. I know. It's so sad. <laughs> Never mind. Like, that's it's clearly like a, a premeditated like a attack. Thing, like, oh. Yeah, that's a premeditated <clears throat> attack situation. That definitely There's a vulnerability better. one that's pretty good, but they can but save the DC, it. The DC is shit, and he has legendary resistance. Like, all I would do yeah. is make him waste a legendary resistance. There's no way. Unless Dutch just wanted to be super kind and was like, I'll allow it because you're in a rough spot. But, like, no, come on. It's dumb. <laughs> well, I do have this a question. Is, like, like, what, when, what I'll say is. There is not a whole lot of campaign left once the dragons have been dealt with, and this is definitely like you're in the end game because after the dragons, there's not much left. So like the anti, it's just the prophecy. The elemental anti is shit. getting up. Like as you go, like every dragon you go after, it gets more and more like like we're oh, we're getting big, it. We're getting into the end game. <laughs> so I'm okay. Upping the anti. Well, is his turn done yet? Uh, yes, his turn is done. It is not yours. You don't have any sympathetic minions, let's be honest. No, I don't. I have none. Okay. That's the problem. All my heals are out. Uh, I'm checking, double checking my obfuscate is only on the one attack. I don't get to do it on all of them, I'm pretty sure, because that would be real sick. It just when an attacker hits you with an attack. So would, that was one attack? Or with the three swings? Or no? Yeah, no, no, no those were three separate attacks. Three attacks. Okay, okay, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Um, how far away? off from me right now okay i mean uh, it's so dumb but desperate desperate like my character wouldn't know any better there's no reason not to do it uh i'm gonna fly up to close you provoke the attack opportunity from oh are you leaving the body no oh shit yeah I true my body. Well, I'm gonna see in my desperation because what I'm trying to do is just make sure get to within 30 feet of Bricksoft so I can okay. point at him and try and make him vulnerable to all damage. But if you the... leave your body, you can keep it from breaking as well. But this opportunity attack. Because you're gonna take the opportunity. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like from the opportunity attack, the body would break. So if she left the body. Yeah, but from the it. the bo yeah, but not from the body. Like, I was like, if I leave the body, the... it's an interesting. Like, does he know and know well enough to? Because he still sees the physical thing in front of him. Would he know enough to then attack the ghost. thing? The ghost leaving? Like, I, I would imagine. I mean, no, sure, by that's the thing that's rules leaving. as written, he would get to because I am still leaving. Like me as the the core entity that... of my person is leaving his melee. Range. Yeah, there's the robot's not what's leaving. Your ghost is leaving. So yeah, 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 yeah. Because as an action, I can point the claw at the dragon, and he gets vulnerability to all damage types, and then I can hope that long? Davian gets until my next turn. So <laughs> I can hope that Davian does some Hail Mary shit. Again, Laura knows there's, there's, there's no way, and it's stupid, but Daigon is just watching one friend's boofed away, one friend's taken away unconscious. I know I have this thing that's specific to dragons. Like, I don't see why I wouldn't do it, you know? Desperate and times, desperate Davian, measures. Davian just had a badass attack last turn. Like I'm literally hoping we can pull off something crazy like that again. Another crit would be so huge. Plus, right now it would be so exciting if this is the time where I finally get the body to fly with me <laughs> after all the times I've tried. Like mm -hmm. this is the risk you have to make because if I feel like once I'm you gonna do it. I'm gonna try to get the body to fly with me. Even if the body gets destroyed, then the body hangs out and my just my the body sinks yeah. and my ghost form rises up yeah. and it's hella dramatic. So yeah, he gets an attack opportunity. So it's six six tiles. So that's five, ten, fifteen. Well, actually, hold up. Before I commit to this, let me see if I go up six tiles. Then how is that? Am I within thirty feet of him? Oh my now god, my up. fucking corpse! <laughs> Dutch, no! <laughs> Stop dropping me! Sorry, okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm not. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm not. Never mind. It doesn't matter. Even if I fly up, I can't get to him. So it is what it is. Um, because he's eight tiles away from me. Even if I fly up. Yeah. Um, if I make it diagonal, here we go. Math, Pythagorean theorem. Stay in school, children. Um. Yeah, well, you kids. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six. And now if I measure this. No, I'm still not. Okay. Okay. <laughs> then we stay in. I am so sorry. Uh, well, very emotional, angsty, dramatic scream from Dagon as watching Brixoff fly off, knowing I am fucking useless. Does the, my dragon claw thingy add a dragon? Would the half dragon be count? Like, could I use it on him? Yep. Okay. Any dragon. Half dragons. Yeah. Creature type dragon. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> Um, then action, we're gonna go ahead and do that. Um, or, yeah, I'm gonna do it and risk, take the attack opportunity. So action is I'm gonna, he is the, the half dragon has to make a con save. I'm gonna try and make him vulnerable to all types of damage. Make him vulnerable to all types of damage? Okay, what's the yeah, save on that again? Yeah, he fails. Uh, con save 15. 14? Hey, okay, something. So that's my action. And then, even though it was my bonus, at, or I'm gonna leave his thing. I'm not gonna, obviously, I could have disengaged. We're gonna do that. And I'm gonna um, hitchhike the bodies out here and hitchhike with Davian. But he gets an attack opportunity on my body first. 21? 21 to hit? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I have my reaction back, so I'll obfuscate the damage. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm not using my reaction. I'm taking it because that's the whole point of why I'm hitchhiking Tabby. 22 points of magic. Body's barely up. Body's still here. Huh? And now I'm with Davian, unless he doesn't want me there for some reason. How? Okay. Is that your turn, Laura? Uh, yeah. And I guess as 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 I go hitchhike with Davian, he hears in its head, I guess it's down to me and you. Fuck! And <laughs> just hears me panicking a little bit. <laughs> okay. Oh, and I'll tell Davian as I enter his body too, as I'm freaking out, that that guy's vulnerable to all damage. Like, I'll be yelling that as I'm running got, back towards him. <laughs> I got some good ideas. <laughs> I got some bad ideas. At this point, we're all desperate. How far from me is this fucking dragon in the air? Even when I went 30 feet in the air, he was still eight tiles away from me. So eight times five, he was still 40 feet away from me. Uh, so I should be able to just... He is diagonally uh, 18 tiles, so 18 times 5. 10 times 5 is 50, 90 feet. 90 feet. 90 feet away. You know it's bad when half of my notes become capital letters. That's how you know shit's getting real. <laughs> normally, they look like this. Now, they look like this. <laughs> Where the fuck is Onu? Shit. Oh. Where uh... is Onu? <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> okay. He's a, goose He's a duck. Now. He's a goose. He's a goose. <laughs> it's a goose. Turn from an owl to a goose, bro. Dude, I'm just picturing now James's character in Final Fantasy XIV because his minion is a goose and he's like this buff, like, you know, warrior running around with his little goose following him. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, hold on. I need to do a little bit of rules shenanigans here. Okay. 
Onu's flight speed is 60 feet. I can use my bonus action to command him. But I think I can also use my action for him to take an action as well. Okay. Like, I think I can use my attack action... I need, to, I need to double check this. You can sacrifice one of your attacks when you take the attack action to command the beast to take the attack action. Take the attack action. So, I can use my bonus action yeah. to command Onu mm -hmm. to dash. Okay. And then I can use an attack to make Onu attack. Yeah. So. Can I. Hand off. The fire quartz to Onu. Oh shit. Um, I mean, I guess so. So that would be your object interaction. Bonus action to make him dash, and then you could use your action to. And and then and then Onu would attack the fire quartz next to the dragon, and okay. send all three of them to the city of brass. Oh shit! <laughs> what? Huh? What? <laughs> hold up, hold up. Rewind. I need I need this repeat. I'm, I'm trying to make some sense here because what is happening? Um What's what's owner's flying speed? Let's start with that. 60 feet. <laughs> that would be close enough. 120 feet. Yes. Um, this is incredible. I can command him to take a dash action with my bonus action. Mhm. Mm and I can command him to attack using one of my attacks. Dutch now reaping, reaping what he sows with the, the items <laughs> he gives us. <laughs> um, I'm just quickly double checking something. It's like forced teleportations, the thing, isn't it? Yeah, why? So it gets weird. It gets, it's an item it gets of my stupid. creation, and I've really thought of okay. making it a saving throw based thing because I figured yeah. if used, everyone would be okay with it. Hmm. Uh, so I'm quickly just. You did think it'd be used for an attack. Exactly. For now. Yep. Like, like why would you to be fair? Like why exactly, would you? Big exactly. brain. So that is my big bad, brain right guess, here. Not predicting yeah. this particular specific scenario where that would be a thing. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so I'm just quickly just checking like um I think when most... smashing this piece of quartz, everyone within twenty feet of the impact point will be instantly transported to the seed of flame. Yeah. But I'm just quickly Okay. Dutch is Dutch, I believe Dutch is saying it is a like writing error in it. Should <laughs> Dutch is like, I, okay, hold be, on. It, it should I, be this is people. ridiculous. Because I know, it be well, not even people, that. Right? Like, never in my imagination would I have thought you would have ever used this quartz in such a way <laughs> that it would be yeah. like, D &D trying to bring a hostile D &D. back to you know someone that could try to object, right? You know what I mean? Oh well, yeah. I'm so, still trying to figure out how that helps us or a Lazarus in this moment. Like it's a lateral move. It seems like you know. <laughs> In, away. Because it is putting... at rules as written in 5e, any form of teleport can only be done on willing creatures. And unwilling creatures... Well, would that just would suck a laser? So right maybe it would function mouth? more like... Would do a save. Um, and again, I'm cognizant enough to be willing. So, my thought process is... <laughs> <laughs> Elazarin is being carried away by a bad man to a yeah. bad place. Yes. Yes. I could teleport Elazarin so that he's being carried by a bad man, but in a good place, Prepare surrounded us. by people <laughs> who want the bad man dead. Okay. Having seen Jax just be disappeared. Okay. okay. Fair. Um, fair. 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 Right. I'll, I'll say yes, but I I'll understand say that because I'll say, for the, sa for the sake of. Consistency, I just made a Lazarin roll to save against a teleport from Jax. I'm gonna I'm gonna 
m implement a quick like DMs like addition mm -hmm. to the rules of the fire court, saying that because it's a teleport, unwilling creatures have to make a save, uh, okay. and the save is constitution based. Uh, oh, and, and it's it'll a have to match a because the, the quartz is quite has like quite potent. Uh, um, um, magic. Magic. I'll say just. just what's, what, what's your spell save DC? My spell save DC is fifteen. Okay. Um, I'll make it fifteen. Okay. To kind of keep it consistent. Okay. Oi. Is that so what you're doing? I, I love this plan. So you way. and Brixoff need to roll a DC. 15 I need to roll save. low. I need to roll. You need low. to roll. Low. You need to roll a yes. less than thirteen. Twelve yeah. and under. We don't care what Brixoff really rolls, to be honest. So, this is one time you rolled a 20. What is your roll? <laughs> I rolled an 11. Duh. 11 on the dice? 11 on the dice. Which? 13. Doesn't that make... Okay, that's a 13, right? 13. 13. Yeah. So. <sighs> so what you did is pog, but has consequences. <laughs> um, Odu flies up. And breaks... The crystal. Yeah, both Brixoff was going. He's turning. <laughs> both Onu. And, can Onu be teleported to a different plane away from you? Yes, right. That's the he can. I think he's probably just gonna be gone, but so I'll resummon him. Onu right. And yeah, Elazarin disappear, and Elazarin you lie you now lie unconscious on like Kosuth's doorstep, essentially. Yeah. That's better li than in li Dragon li Bell. Li li literally, it's done operation just like no, no, no. Your Amazon package never said it was <laughs> But Ring doorbell. <laughs> As a legendary <laughs> action. He sees this. Rick Soth just looks back. Did you get a counter spell? And just shouts. If it was you that wanted to come with me, you should have oh, just no. said so. Oh, and no. he just 180. Oh okay. good. I can't anything, help anyone! Anything else to your turn there? <coughs> um, well, oh, well, well, right? uh, what did I use? I used my bonus action and I action. used my action. If you have movement, we so all that's left is my movement. All that's left is my movement. Can you use one, uh, one attack action? Do you still have one more attack action? Still I do still have an attack maybe? action. I do still have. Yeah. Okay. You know what? Yeah. Before I stop running. You can attack the vulnerable man. I'm going to shoot. I'm going to shoot this loser over here real quick. There's this massive dragon fight going on. We're like. One second. One second. Fuck off. Sure. Okay. It, it, it wasn't good. Uh, 15. Misses. Fuck. 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 Oh. Fuck. God. We're so no, fucked. Let's, so let's, let's, let's go. So Wait, I think I can go this far. You. Hey, man, you guys, you, get, you, get, you guys are free. You guys are out. It was safe. Um, I... Is that your turn, Davian? He just left me. He just left me to go. Yes. <laughs> Jax, you're doing nothing. Oh, um, hold, 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 wait, can't do that, that, that takes 10 minutes. I'm um, you're, you're, you're incapacitated no. because you're banished, um, you're incapacitated because you're banished. Am I really incapacitated yeah. from that? Yeah. yeah. The duration of the spell, you'll be incapacitated in a harmless demiplane. Yeah. So you'll be gone nice. for the next minute, the next, like, nine more turns. You're Bro, gone. you better answer the door when I knock, because I'm coming over to fuck your mom, all right? <laughs> Lazarus, even <laughs> though you're you now right unconscious now, on Kosu's doorstep, safe. I need you to make it that saving throw. Yeah, of course. <laughs> We would, now we will never know. We won't know if a Lazarus dead. We can go back to the plate of fire. It's like, so, this package you sent me, uh, it arrived broken. I don't know, man. I usually get a refund. <laughs> I need to send it back. <laughs> what is happening? Rixoff? Yeah. Where are we? It's going to roll with double check. Oh, like, for purposes, you can make my character next to Davy because I'm hitchhiking with him. Yeah, that's fine. Or you can leave my character there to show where the body is, <laughs> lying on the ground. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Psycho sends me such the cutest messages. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how it feels 40, to be in a cool. 50, 60, yeah. Banished every fight. It's great. Do you know it's so good? I don't know. I can actually do something. There's a fucking tree in the way, dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's a fucking tree in the way. Oh, my heartbeat right now. 
I can't. There's a tree in the way. <laughs> It's Bro, he dies. He dies. The tree kills him. The tree the spears tree, him in the he heart. He impaled himself on a tree. It's great because I'm just win. big chilling. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. What's fuck up? Bleeding out <laughs> down in the fucking plate of fire. Yeah. Davian. I gotta set that fire resistor. Twenty-seven hits. Uh, but uh, I. Oh. Yeah. Nope. Even if I divine barrier, I think that's still gonna hit. Twenty-six hits. So probably no point. You need divine yeah. barrier if you're not inside him. I am inside him right hits. now. Oh. Just, just hit. Yeah. I will. With the twenty-six, with the twenty-six, still. If I up your AC by four, that still hits. Yes. Okay. Fuck. Yeah. He's not like me. He's this man. He's is not weird. The Lazarin, yeah. Motherfucker. I've got like nine or something stupid. Right? No. Yeah. He's got like a twenty AC. Motherfucker. I said that. That much AC, like seventeen. Eighteen. Oh, it's eighteen. That's eight. It's higher. Uh, so maybe that was hard because you had, like, haste on. 59 points of piercing damage. Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> oh. This is bad. Everything's bad. This is real bad in here. He was going. Oh, man. Like, <laughs> he was going. He was damage. going with you. 26 points of poison damage. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Are you still up? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> And that's his turn. After I was all wait, what was what was the first part of the damage? It was poison and what else? Piercing. Okay. Eight. Um, that's then half. What if for me? What if Kasuth just sends a Lazarin to Davian being held by Brute? Fuck. Wait, how much? How much was it? Hold on. How much was the piercing? Fifty something. I don't remember. <laughs> it's like fifty-six, I think. Okay, um, then I'll use my reaction and obfuscate it. So it's it was half because well, I'm resistant. Well, no. Resistant. Because those are three separate attacks. So you can't obfuscate the total. You would have to... Oh. Uh, mm. Oh, right. What so... was... Okay, can you give them to me individually? Because I need that for reasons. I'm so sorry. Because I'm in there. Like, all of them would be, like, in the... It, like, like... I don't remember because I didn't fucking write it down. I just fucking rolled it and said it out loud. I'm so sorry. Um, what, what's the, the average? I'll just like, take what, the average. What's the yeah, uh, and I'll have that. Just say 20 points of damage. Uh, no, because each I of them lie. individually. I tell a lie. I tell a lie. 24 points of damage. Well, I... Okay. Because, okay. okay, this so, is the poison with the thing. Well, all of them are halved regardless because me, but then I'm going to obfuscate one down to a quarter. So that's the problem. So it was 57 total? Yeah. So then half that down to 28. What's math? Mm -hmm. uh, well, be... But then one of those would be a little less because I would then quarter. So let's say I'm going to say I'm just I'm going to say I take 20. I yeah, feel sure. like that's close. <laughs> just... Is it too late well, okay. to uh, hellish rebuke this bitch? No. No. Okay. Do it. Yeah, because regardless, Dora, on He's one of those hits, it'll be 20 well, right? half to 10, and then it'll be 20, so. 20, 40, it's like 50 to 25, really. Like, yeah. roughly. That that's be the rough average. It'd be 25. Yeah, okay. uh, Is it considered grapple now, Dutch, as well? No. No, you okay. got clawed, not bit. Ah, right. Well, you got bit. You're all right. But oh, you got bit. Oh, sorry. You got De bit deck saving throw, please. Oh, Gee, I Big wonder Dargan. if you'll make it. <laughs> um, 24. Okay. You take half damage. <laughs> You <laughs> lucky. You're lucky. You might survive this. Oh shit. Two d ten. Three d ten. Three d ten for a total of ten. Half to five points of oh, fire oh, damage. That was just enough. The half dragon is just going to take his like large axe and he's just gonna fuck it at you. Bitch. This is just like like fifteen foot long axe just soars towards you. Uh, Probably makes like one revolution before it hits. My god, that is a 30 20. <laughs> Give it a spin on it. Oh, and I used my reaction, so I you can't divide the I'm so right dead now. now. Well, I'm fucked now. Um, <laughs> yeah, 30 20 hits, yeah. And I used my reaction to obfuscate the last one. I could have protected us both from that one. Fuck! I'm mad at myself. This is an improvised weapon, man. Like, what What are we doing here? 24 no, what if this thrown? Magical. How much? Magical slash. Yeah, that's magical exact. Magic, so I can't even half that. That's, that's exactly enough. enough. Oh really? That's such a good idea too. Yeah, that stinks. Well. So you are yeah, I'm unconscious. So 
As yeah. Davian falls unconscious, his body falls, but my body stays standing there, mm -hmm. and I'm standing there barely glowing. I'm glowing real dim. <laughs> Bro, if Jax goes back to the party being fucking dead... And as a legendary action, Rixoth will look at Daigon. Oh god, I'm just gonna head in the weekly way. Hey. <laughs> Should have let me go. I didn't do shit! And is going to... I didn't do anything! Wait, wait. Daigon's gonna be dead dead. Daigon's dead dead. Daigon's dead dead. I can get to roll death saves. I can get to roll death saves. Death saves. I know, but like... Who's gonna fix uh, me? That's a dirty 20 to No hit. one can Daigon. fix either one of you. That's a what, sorry? Dirty 20 to hit. Well, yeah, in about like I'm, a minute, you can go back. I'm not even in the body of a ghost. I'm squishy. I'll no. come back in a minute and everyone's no, dead. No, 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 Jax, you have enough time because it's a minute since they died for Revivify. So you have enough time to get back from the banishment. Can't Revivify Daigon. Can't Revivify Daigon. Ghost. Well, I'm, at I'm least one of them can be revived. I only have one Revivify anyways. Well, that's fine. You can't get rid of one of them. I can Cause you have the spell refuel ring. Twenty-two Shit. points of magical, no, not magical. Twenty-two points of normal piercing damage. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm unconscious. Get the diamonds. Oh, okay, well, diamond. I don't have to oh, I diamond. So Daigon is now also unconscious. <laughs> oh god. And I would like to make you to make me a death save. DM. Me? <laughs> me? Well, this is ten soon. This got chaotic real quick, boys. Let me tell you. Why, dude? <laughs> Woo! What a it's rush. Such, it's, it's such a shame because it was like such a good idea, but it has. Yeah, get like <laughs> high risk, high reward, and oh boy, was the risk. <laughs> yeah, he just yeah, oh, dude, there's no, there's to be no fair, situation here. No when I conducted situation. my risk assessment, the risks yeah. were very different. <laughs> Wait, yeah, I know. Before the to DM be, said, be, oh, I'm actually gonna add a saving throw. To be fair, so to be fair as well, like fucking pog like yeah, it's, it was so cool it's <laughs> it was such a sick idea like it's, it's so brilliant good. no it's it is brilliant like i hope you understand my reasoning for that though duke like we've all we'll see the side i would be dude if the dragons that last on your attack fighting didn't above do your pay exactly here. my hp with like a last ditch thrown fucking whatever hucking a huge yeah. axe of me mm -hmm. i would be so cool right now but i am yeah. livid yeah. I am livid because you all know my next move was to smash the fucking staff of power or whatever yep. the fuck happened. Yep. Happen. Yep. Yep. That's just, I knew he was yeah. gonna fucking do that too. I, and I can't do that. Uh, on that note, can you make me a death save, please? If I was, if I was left alive, I could have taken yeah. your staff and smashed it as a last ditch resort too. Fuck. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Instead, I come back in a minute and then I do it and kill all of us. Oh, I you do it. I was doing the group we're, taking, we're taking them with me, you know. <laughs> do it, Jax. <laughs> okay, do, oh. do it, pussy. Okay. Lazarin. Is he still rolling? And I would like everyone. To <laughs> Deafen <laughs> as Kosu okay. gets, you, you gets of... his package. <laughs> Lazarin. Hello. You lie unconscious in the city of Brass. God, this got chaotic real fast. Do you want me to roll my last death saving throw? I'd like you to roll your last. It's another three. It is a failure. I'm dead. And with that... Your last breath. Body. That is until you suddenly feel a force attempting to pull you back if you let it. I... I don't make a roll on this. I don't know. I don't know what Lazarus' brain is at the moment. I don't take... I, I, I can't back. And as you open your eyes see towering above you is Kosuth. Quite rude. You just appear on my doorstep to then just die. What happened? Um, um, uh, uh, in the Whispering Woods, Rixoth came. He found us. And last I remember, I was being chomped on down by a dragon. 
I don't remember anything here else, and now I'm suddenly here. So sorry for my um, rude uh, arrival, but um, I that's the last I know. I don't know what Brixoth has done now that I'm not there because he was. T I don't. I don't know what. I don't. I don't know mm. what he was doing. I was. From the sounds of it, from the last thing I remember hearing, it sounds like he was going to take me captive, but I don't know past that anymore. So I don't know where the others are, I need to get back to them. Alright. We're going to end your turn there, for Cool. <clears throat> okay, we're all back. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Okay. How many of us died? Rixoth. Oh, Jesus. I mean, everyone's dead. Well, unconscious. <laughs> is going to pick up Davian. <gasps> oh, no. And dart off. <laughs> leaving Daigon there to die. This is so sad. It did the same thing. It's on their map, but fuck it. You know, Where are my Spriggans, you know? <clears throat> With a bunch of kobolds right now. Where's my Spriggan army? Like, hell, we'll save him. The half dragon walks up to Daigon. Oh, come. Oh, my God. This will be, be almost TPK, except for Jax, the lone survivor. Well, I, Kess and Brooks, I guess. You'll, it'll be you three. <laughs> this is bad, too. What's your, what's your AC? Um, as a ghost? Uh, with, like Jax's in, with Jax's infusion, 15. 15? <laughs> Miss my first attack. Plus two from oh, with advantage, let's miss go. my first attack. What? Let's go. Let's go. Did you roll like one and two? Hit my second attack. Did okay. he pull his sword out of my body? Ima <laughs> imagine Brick was just fucked up with his massive with the sword No, I like, yeah, yeah. didn't like play. Uh, I don't know. Um, yeah. Which is okay. an auto crit. It's an auto crit, so it's two. Okay. He does And with okay. that, Dragon's ghostly form. I'm never gonna get to, to use the fucking figurine. This is bullshit. I didn't even get to say goodbye. Davian. Make a death save. I need. Hold on. I dropped my, like, good die. And I don't know. I don't know where it went. So I guess all I'll stuff without uh... do is just drop them in the forest randomly, too. And, like, we'd Ooh. never find them. I guess I'll make a sacrifice and or pick a random one. Okay. Jax, incapacitated. Um, I'd like to roll for heart attack. <laughs> Fuck off. Nope, rolling for heart attack. And it's only 67. Good. Elazarin, mm -hmm. upon your turn, a fiery portal appears. And you kind of just get ushered through by Kosuth. And Kosuth also joins you through the portal to see this half-dragon, and Kosuth just flicks his wrist, and the half-dragon just gets incinerated. Oh, where were you 30 seconds ago? You might uh, yeah. well, There's a fun thing yeah, called well, a turn Welcome order. to Davian's entire campaign. There's a funny Laura. thing called a, me a, me a mechanic in the game called a turn order. <laughs> where? Okay, but like, in in the real, like, there, it's not like a chronological yeah, 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 yeah. happening simultaneously. Where the fuck were you six seconds ago? <laughs> Elazarin? Ah! Uh, you look around, and you see Brixoth on the horizon, flying away. No sign of Davian, no sign of Daigon, except we'll say ectoplasm. there is a puddle of ectoplasm. And you can very, very faintly see ghostly particles kind of dissipating slowly, which makes you realize of a good guess of what happened. From body's still there, smoking. What we know, <laughs> there was no Great. with Daigons. There's no chance of revival 
other than like Wish or True Resurrection. Resurrection. Right. So no. Correct. Um, okay. So should you fall to zero hit points, you begin fading. Should you fail three death save, your spirit withers away into the ether. Your soul is cast into the vaults of the underworld and cannot be recovered or resurrected outside the use of a wish spell. Not even true resurrection, only wish, a wish spell wish. gets me back. Okay. I. That's uh, depressing. I look over, watching Davian go. And I would like to do a divine intervention. Oh, oh, oh. Fucking hit the roll, dude. That'd be so fucking. It'd be very sick. poetic if this is the time. Wait, but you rolled it last week. You fucking hit it last week, bro. I did. I jokingly hit it last week because oh, I was like, I haven't done a day of my intervention. You missed as soon as you hit it. I have to roll 11. an eleven no, or level. lower. An eleven. Level. My level or lower. He's got an eleven percent chance. Well. No. Oh. It's a 90. <laughs> Four. So you the wrong know. side. Oh. Okay. The wrong side of the coin. Okay. So I sort of hold on to like my thing. I just look and I just like tears in my eyes, almost like a scream. Just a no! And feel no connection. And I yeah. fall to the floor. Can we eat Dutch just, just for. Hmm? Flavor's sake, because of course I eventually now I did figure out because the whole also thing was if I ever achieved like as a lingering soul, if you ever achieved your like reason for coming back, you mm -hmm. would then fade away as well. Which obviously, I did not. Uh, just even though there's like like can we say like I my my ghostly energy held on until one of the party could come back just to, so they hear one final like message in their head and then mm -hmm. fades. So just as a Lazarus does that, he just hears in my voice the back of his head a faint, barely audible. Just I'm sorry. The worst bit is of all the people to hear these last words, like, that was the worst because he still feels so guilty this even happened to you. With that said, <laughs> so, like... Kosuth looks around and looks at you. And at this point, Jax, you <laughs> reappear throughout the combat. <laughs> and you see outside of the gate, you see Kosuth, this large fireman. Elazarin, no one else. I just, you see Elazarin on the, f like, knelt down on the floor, head just hung low, just crying, endless screaming, just out to the void. So and looks down, I looks play down and you. playing it like, because if going, get him, get him! I can feel that he's still alive. Okay. May have lost one companion today. You don't have to lose more. But in order to get to him, you know what you have to do. You have to continue. You cannot give up now. And like takes a second. Another moment. And I will. I've said, like, when I know, then I've dropped, like, my sword on the floor. And I will pick up the Dragon Bone Cleaver. And I just will look at Jax and just oh. go. And just go. Mm. We get our revenge. I we are soldiers now. There's a fucking dragon to hunt. And I will put the sword away. And I'm going to see this fucking king get out of here. Kosuf looks have, at you. I have a question. Wait, two seconds. Uh, Kosuth looks at you, and you can see him kind of, like, cr crushing air in his fist. And he hands you this red gem. It is very faintly, kind of just, almost beating like a heart. This is connected to Davian's life force. This stops beating. I'll hand it to you. I will tie it around <laughs> and try and make it part of my uh, necklace that already has like mm -hmm. the fucking Joaquin symbol that has like the, the the heart of the earth and I have that and I'll make sure it's always tucked and I can always feel it. Mm -hmm. So I have a question. Yep. 
the claw of the worm rune I I wasn't using it as an item. I consumed the enchantment, right? And that's how I was able to use it. Like, it fused my body. So there's no way it's recoverable to them. Like, um, that's just also gone forever. Motherfucker. Okay. Great. Unless... Because I was going to say, otherwise, could it, like, some pop off very my body and the claws, like, lying heavily there? heavily <laughs> flavored artificer RP. We I might be Jax, able to figure Jax could, like, remove it out of my body and try you know, and Jax being a very magic. crafty, tinkering man, he might be able to figure something out. But definitely not right yeah. now. Um, yeah, not right this second. I don't think said, still, body out of here. As you all um, kind of gathered here, I would like everyone to deafen for a moment, except for Davian. For oh, God. God's. Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> God. Do I have to deafen? I'm dead. I'm not coming back. Like, I. Uh, for, the, I for the sake of, like, table spoilers, yeah. Definitely. Okay, okay, fine. <laughs> fine, fine, fine. Go back! I think he's DC because oh, his camera just broke. Oh, yeah, well. what the fuck? Uh. Well, ain't that interesting? <laughs> Walkie porkies! <laughs> Okay. Can I just like disconnect him? Bro, I guess I can server deafen him. So just in you... case he comes back. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Davian. Mm. You feel a sudden kind of like prick. As your eyes open, you can see that. Just a second. Now everything is fucked. <laughs> scene wise. <laughs> Damn it. Um. So I'm double wide. Hold on. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Fuck. Okay. God. Um Yeah, I'm <laughs> Um so you feel a, a a very sudden like kind of like sting a prick mm. as you're still soaring high above the tree line. <gasps> Completely, like, still, like, very much incapacitated. And you just hear Brixoth's voice in your head. Put on tight. And he flies, and then suddenly... <laughs> your entire environment changes. As you are now suddenly... As he kind of, kind of like, crash lands inside this gargantuan cave. And you see... Before you, green dragon being Brixaw, a white dragon, uh, a white dragon, as well as a individual wearing this very ornate looking spider armor with a helmet covering their face. These two dragons and this individual stand before you. They all have their weapon, like they, they both, the dragons both mouth wide open looking at you and the individual in the armor just sword aimed at you. You hear this very distorted voice coming from this individual with, with the helmet on. Toss your belongings. Side. Um, am I able to move now? Am I like... You are not bound. You're I'm not reason... incapacitated anymore? No, the only reason you were incapacitated was because he was basically clenching his jaws for not allowing you to move. You yeah, have okay. These two dragons I'll, I'll... with their like, mouth open, ready to fucking go. And this I mean, yeah, I... Like... I don't even wear armor, so I'll just take off the death jaws visage. Bag. They're like nodding. So I'm basically just like, basically telling you to disarm yourself. Yeah. Uh, can I smash the staff of power on the floor? If you want to. If you want to. It's a 50 50. Hmm? Of either guaranteed death or being spat out. God knows where. I mean, it's straight up 50-50. So...
there are five charges left in the staff. Mm -hmm. I can use an action to break it. The staff is destroyed. And I have a 50% chance to instantly travel to a random plane of existence. Avoiding the explosion. If I fail to avoid it, I will take... You're dead. 80 damage. Not dead, per se, I guess. But... No. Well, no, but sealing my fate. I'll say... <clears throat> um, if... You know, I understand the the, 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 the consideration. Um, but you have three individuals, two of which being dragons, that are paying close attention to what you do. It's, yes. But it's one action to smash it against a solid surface. You know what I mean? It's like, I'm disarming myself, bang, like that, and it's done. Like, boom. But... But Davian's self preservation, I don't think. Having done what he wanted to do, I don't think he's desperate now to the point. So he, uh, he like clenches his fist around the shaft of the staff mm -hmm. and drops it to one side with a clatter, followed by the rest of his belongings. As you do that, uh, the armored individual immediately kicks all your stuff out of your reach. <clears throat> and you see two dragons shapeshifting. Hailcutter, the white dragon, transforms into this Bald Goliath. He breaks off. Turns into a person you've met before. Orange skinned tiefling. No, is valid. The Lazarin's Nightweb. <gasps> He's gonna be so mad. And he He's looks... gonna be so mad. And Valor approaches you and looks at you. It was supposed to be him. We just had to get in our way. I think I've got quite a neck for that. I think we all do. We are too close. Our plans come into fruition. But. Bet not. You'll see your friends again. On our turn. And he, unless, like, he attempts to jam this blade in your arm. So, mm. 19 to hit. Well, uh, my AC without Death Jaw's Visage, mm. uh, well, with Death, Death Jaw's Visage is 18, so, but without it is 15. Uh, make a constitution saving throw. Actually, no, it's not. It's lower than that, even, because I don't have the staff of power anymore, either. Uh, constitution saving throw. Mm -hmm. I unfortunately don't win these. Twelve. As you begin to fade in and out of consciousness, as this whatever substance that coated the blade takes effect, you see... ...individual that wasn't a dragon would take their helmet off to reveal another being another person you've met before. The Emperor's Emissary. And we go. And then lights go out. Interesting. You, Very interesting. For the sake of this, you are now captured by, mm. say, the Nightwebs. So, given that they've already decided that you ever going after him, um, 
I guess best we can do is you just make a new character that you play for a little bit. Kind of the same way we did, um, unless you're like, oh, no, I'll dip for the next few weeks, but I don't know. Seems a bit lame. Um, just play like a character that kind of the party runs into and helps them along until they get Davian back. Unless you're like well, opposed to that. Well, given the, uh, I don't remember his name. Was it like, it was like Cinder or, uh, what, was, what the fuck is my planar ally's name? Oh, fuck. Um... Uh, oh, so nice server Devon, we can still hear server him. Server Devon, not server muted. Interesting. All right. <laughs> <It's not right. laughs> uh, I think it, I think it was Cinder. That sounds right, but I fucking can't remember where I put it. But that sounds right. But yeah, but given Kalsuthas just already had like FaceTime with yeah. the gang, mm -hmm. uh, I could. I could play my planar ally. Oh! Call Suth is just like, hey, here's the homie. Take him with you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That works. Well, I mean, I still technically have the brand of Kasuth because it's fucking branded on my skin. Like, Davian's out there. I, I was mm -hmm. thinking, like, is there something I can pull to summon him? But no, no. Call Suth can just, like, be like, hey, take, take the fireman. Okay. I don't know what class he was. Uh, he's just an Afrit. I'm it's sure you have a, sheet and notes from somewhere. A, a, a... Oh, okay. So I, um, could I turn that into something? Workshop it? Yeah, yeah. If he's an Ifri, it would be like a genie warlock, probably. But Pretty... uh, Well, we can workshop that. We can, we can workshop yeah, yeah. that. And even okay. if it's not Cinder, we could just say that, I don't know. I, I yeah. Send some other, like, only yeah. of the fire. Okay. <clears throat> right. Um, yeah. Pick up this and run off. I just deafened myself by accident. <laughs> okay. You you might as well keep Kobe seven muted until he comes back. Oh yeah, true. Sure. Oh, okay, sorry, Jesus. Uh, I mean, Koiba, I, I serve him muted Koiba because he like came back in the middle of all that. Yeah. Dude, um, Bailey out here adding insult to injury, literally already eating my Daigon character sheet. Like, you don't need this anymore. Like, fuck yeah. you. It's rude. Feline on feline crime. So, literally. Um, Jax and Elazarin. You're standing there with Kasuth, and Kasuth gave Elazarin this, and, and, and you guys decide. Obviously, Roxanne. Um... That you should get going. Um, there is not right. We're back. We're back quick. Before you guys, uh, and we'll do it like this. Oh. We'll do it like this. You know, Davian is alive, Elazrin. Yeah. And Kosuth will look at you. Um, there is another way. I can help. And he conjures up another portal. And you begin to see this shadow in the portal getting closer and closer. I also believe I'm on one HP, right? Yeah. Do, I? yeah, yeah. Okay. Getting closer and cool. closer. As someone is on the way to step out of the portal. Oh, shit. Who is it? And we'll leave it here until next week. Oh! I know something you don't know. Yeah, I'm going to need you to keep that to yourself. I know something you don't know. I know to... a couple things you don't know. I know a few things you don't know. You know, know many things we don't know at this the point. The whole I'm goal sure. was I know if someone successfully got taken, they would learn some like revelating shit that they would have to like. Kind of oh. I will tell you all right now. I edged <laughs> the staff of power. You did. Mm -hmm. Do you know if what's after, about after we go there for this? a rescue mission, we go to rescue you, find out Davian committed suicide with the staff. <laughs> or we have, better we yet, have the orb that tells us if he's alive. Oh, so, true. Or, yes, but. True. More confusingly, you show up to save me, and I'm not there because on the 50-50 chance I succeed, I get transported oh. to a random plane oh, of existence. Shit. So <laughs> I smashed this type of power and just went to limbo, and I'm just Man's like hanging out. The worst thing. You come show up underworld with me. 
all all of this is going on, I'm thinking I could have probably saved myself if I had one HP. He's just chilling yeah. in the uh, the planet okay, mechanics. I could have got out. I could have got out. I could have saved myself if I had one HP. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> Unfortunately. I could have saved everyone if I didn't get fucking banished. Um, I just want to like kind of a little aftercare here. Yeah. <laughs> I I, I you. hope you didn't feel oh. like this was super unreasonable or super unfair. No. No. I hope that despite no. things going pretty fucking tits up and especially the whole uh quartz thing, I like retroactively being like, mm -hmm. No, the quartz thing is is um, is fine. It was the one fucking damage that took yeah. the staff out of my hands. Yeah. It was uh, I hope I really wanted to go out with a bang. You know, yeah. Like, I mean it makes and, sense too, because yeah. dragons are dragons are incredibly petty. Yeah. Dragons hate being shown up. The minute like Davia not only did that like giant hit of damage and then the quartz thing. I see I mean that's two times now he feels like he's been Okay. Outsmarted or outplayed by this peon, like basically. I will say, like, fuck this. Miscal miscalculated the damage. It, was, it would have been, only been ninety, but yeah. still pretty wild. Because mm -hmm. one, Hunter's Mark wasn't on the dragon. Two, mm -hmm. Branding Smite is concentration, mm -hmm. which uh, would have cancelled the mark. Hunter's Mark anyway. Oh right, right, right. So it was only ninety damage, not a hundred and one. Yeah. But uh, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys don't feel like oh, what great. happened today was my intention with this whole dragon adventure is um, like I don't want to say that this encounter like it was definitely scripted in a sense that whatever the second dragon was that you were going to go after would ramp up mm -hmm. the, the the risk. And there would have been an encounter like this with whatever dragon you would have gone for next. Or one of yeah. you... It was very high likelihood that one of you got yoinked. Unless, you know? Um, I knew yeah. one of us would get yoinked at some point. I thought it was going to be after this one on the route to the next one. <laughs> I, thought too. And I was but, like, I'll be um, fine. You'll also notice that the pacing is going to... It's, it's going to oh, pick up. Yeah. It's going to pick up. Um, for two reasons. One... Um, <laughs> up in the ante and making it kind of like it's we're in the final like we're in the final stretch when it comes to uh main storyline shenanigans um yeah so we're gonna we're gonna up the ante we're gonna pick up the pace and every session is gonna feel like death every session oh, from here on out is gonna feel like <laughs> man someone might not look it out um <clears throat> secondly episode, bro. also because um as far as length of this campaign goes it's been going on for a while and i have a natural i have an ending point in mind when it comes to the main storyline and any other like quest lines that you want to do before then you can do once the dragon part is over and we're going to basically the way the campaign is going to be is like the whole dragon chapter room for side quests other storylines if you want to go end that's basically the remainder of this campaign um, so there's not much left besides killing the dragons and then basically what's going to trigger the go end is when you guys finally have that meeting with like the fucking council or mm -hmm. whatever. Um, mm -hmm. So like even though it feels like we have a whole lot of shit to go um, session wise yeah. we're, definitely, we're definitely in the latter like third the last third mm -hmm. of the yeah. campaign um, which is why things are like I'm ramping up the pace and I'm ramping up the, 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 mm -hmm. the risk but I want I want to make sure that you know I hope you guys still find it fair with stuff. Oh that yeah, that was yeah. that was great. Because uh, it brings me no pleasure. I get super nervous when when I have to when I pull this sort of shit out of my fucking ass. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, hey man, so I want many, to make sure that you guys are all, like, I... cool with it and all that shit. But okay, beautiful. Yeah, well, yeah. Um, with that said, Laura, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yeah, okay, rest like, in peace, Dagon, for the second time. Because it's, it's going down time. all the time. Like, it makes... I was on borrowed time anyway, right? Like, it's not... Um, hopefully you're not no, angry. We're gonna find a way to <laughs> hopefully you're not angry with me. Uh... No. Well, that, that <laughs> yeah, was just... Because when I, when I died the first time, I had a backup character idea. Mm. And what, with what we knew about the campaign, I feel like it would have been a really easy integration. Now, I don't think it works anymore. So I'm going to talk to you about making... Yeah, and if you feel do, like you need more time... If you, if you feel like a one week is rushed... Well, 
Well, um, it's not my problem is I would love to play next week because after that I have like a three week break because of the film festival. Mm -hmm. But then it's is it stupid for me to make a new character and introduce next week and then not be here for yeah. three weeks, even though it means I don't play for a month and I will cry inside. I guess I should make the wise decision and just wait yep. for a month to introduce my new character. Oh, that sucks. And then we have loads of time to sucks. come but... up with a fun, but that does, but that does yeah. suck. Because I would I'll, love I'll next week up, was going to be my that, last I'll, session I'll, I'll, I'll for a break. up to you. I just think about it. Think about what you ruined everything, Dutch. How dare you? Storytelling wise. Well, also, well, I'll say we might need to have a collab sesh where I go, here's the only kind of ideas I have for a character to help yeah. figure out how they fit into this because it's I've so late in the game. I've got two more weeks off right? work, so you can literally hit me up anytime. I got nothing else. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> like, maybe I just let it take it as a sign and then I just start my break early and then I'm going to show up in four sessions. You know what the worst part Surprise. is? We could have pushed this off to next week. Some app. We could have. We yeah. were so close to pushing it off we to next week. Quit yeah. early we were so close. We did, yeah. And oh, I kind I of like, like I kind of went like, whole party here. you know, when, when so Duke was like, I can, I can, I can do, it. you know, I could do combat. I was like, mm, sure. <laughs> sure. Hey, you're the DM, man. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I just, you know, as long as everyone feels like this was fun yeah, and it was fair and it was, great. no, I it was fun. I think there was only one problem. What? It's all Ethan and Bill's fault. I really 100% I did want to know I did want to see just this whole ass dragon just whoop, into the fucking plane of fire yeah. that would have been yeah, funny that been that that, but then, like, probably would have all... ended terribly because that puts two yeah. dragons in the plane of fire, plane like, of fire. Yeah. waging war against one but right outside you know in, in the most vulnerable spot that you could just end up getting destroyed who knows but yeah oh, I mean, the most vulnerable spot for that entire fucking place <sighs> like, in, in terms of in, into character drama that went yeah. about as well as it probably could have. Yeah. Damn, I mean, just straight up said, No, me. Yeah. L literally, literally, you like, I'm Take tagging you out. Uh, yeah. And instead, Love. Uh, Davian learned some very fucking interesting information that. Already have. Yes, he did. The, Too bad he'll if die he, if he lives tell us. through his like, captivity. Survivor Guilt 1 Fight. has already been accomplished. Now, Survivor Ultimate Guilt 2 is. With that done. said, you all level up. Oh yeah! So hey. hey. Wait, it doesn't hey. even apply though to like our long rest, right? Yeah, to a long rest. Yeah, but no. Yeah, we'll what see. the fuck are you two gonna okay. do right now? So should we roll for HP then right now? Just so uh, it's like can do. Uh, I guess yeah. I mean, Laura, you can start your next character at like level <laughs> twelve. Well, uh, da uh, Duke. Yeah, roll for HP you for can level up Davian. Wait. Uh, but then yeah. and then what? Oh, we'll just have to. We'll have to talk this week as well about what you want to do characterize. Yeah, I, I DM'd you. Meantime. Because Duke An is going to come back as, as like the a, a, little thing, as a substitute yeah. teacher, basically. But same, yeah. same with uh, Razzy. Uh, yeah. Uh, kind of like a, a Yo, of... maybe, maybe I bring back Razzy. <laughs> <I'm at Deadpool. laughs> we just bring back my old character. Fuck it. Uh, Yo, yeah. I rolled an eight. Let's go, Pogging. I rolled a seven, dude. I'm happy. Yeah. I'm not happy. Oh, man, I, I'm happy because Dagon's dead. Fucking, I'm oh. stressed. I hope, I really hope you guys aren't mad at me. Uh, <laughs> no, okay, it. Dutch, you, okay, you want to know the one reason I am actually mad at you? Cool. Cool. And I, I feel like I actually have a right to be mad at you for this. Okay. Oh my god, did we get You gave me a fucking Dagon figurine. True. Do you have a memento of me now oh, that you fucked. can keep forever? Oh, that's fucked. It's and, so fucked. And Davian. And Davian, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I might it's not so get these either one. Wait! What? Davian Would it manipulate my body? Davian is still alive. <laughs> Whatever's happening to Davian in that cave. Great. Yeah, the, the thanks. Thanks, will... Dutch. I'm so glad that'll work. Mimic in a very ridiculous Super way. Super cool. Thanks, bro. Thanks. <laughs> that is cool. You might learn something about where he is. <laughs> like, I don't know. We can figure it out. Oh, God. I'm fucking stressed, dude. I'm going to go fucking shit myself. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Ecto, appreciate you, homie. Um, fuck. Yeah, if you guys have any questions or things you want to talk about in between now and next session, just let me know. Uh, a lot happened tonight, so I'm sure Everything. things might come up after the fact. You're like, oh, wait a second. Uh, let me wait know. But uh, we out, gamers. Have a good night. Chat, catch you all next you. Sunday. Kisses. Bye-bye-bye.